Hello. 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 And welcome to Just Casting. You're back with me, Kyle. And I'm Dave. Alex. And Jose. So that was the gayest thing I've ever been Yeah, that was ever. really gay. We did it like five times. I know. Like, <laughs> <laughs> Realistically, I think it was five times. Case, yeah, I think it was. Oh, well, well, we wanted a new type of entry. No, I, was so we experimented. I was against it. Well, there it. was three oh, for it, so fuck you. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> And I really should keep track of how many times Dave say fuck you. That's one. That is one. Oh, we have a Dave fuck you counter. That's I feel like we should. <laughs> I feel like if we keep a counter every time, every, like all we're gonna say is that's another Dave fuck you. Like, like, uh, it was it was it was a cute idea in my head. No, no, you're gonna keep the counter. <laughs> Alex, well, fuck I'm, you, Jose. You're gonna keep no, the counter. No, no, no. We'll just we'll we'll. Just not talk about <laughs> He's it. Like, we'll not right. talk about it, Jose. And we'll just keep it and tell. tell and and then yeah. right at the end of the episode, Dave yeah. said 170 <laughs> fuck yous. That's worse than Lewis Black. Jesus Christ. Um, Put that on the list. <laughs> <laughs> I remember that show. What show? That weird show. It was like, he was like a jerk. Oh, Root of All Judge. Evil? That was so yeah. weird. Just talk into the mic. You can't. Yes. You get your own mic, and you can't even so fucking yeah, talk into it. <laughs> yeah, that's an update. We're finally working as like equals. I, I yeah, an actual head, unit. Head, head talking, head yeah. talking my laptop. Everyone's got their own mics. Uh, Alex and Dave aren't cuddling anymore. Oh, oh Alex <laughs> is talking into mics. This is why we didn't give you one. Well, <laughs> well, we're still gonna cuddle. Probably. This is a trial <laughs> mic, Alex. Oh, sweet Jesus. I don't know what. What the fuck are you doing? He needs to plug in his laptop. Oh, God, there's an out. Oh, it's a <laughs> that's where the equipment's plugged in, Dave. Get a fucking ex- uh, ex- what the fuck? Electric splitter. Fuck you. Anyway, put that down. <laughs> <laughs> well, if, you, if, if you say put that down, I'm not gonna count it. Oh, damn yeah, it. yeah, yeah. All right, fine. So, Dave, we recorded the other day. You were not here. Oh, what'd you do? It wasn't that good of an episode. Oh, okay. Yeah, do you, I don't think it'll go up. It, yeah, there were parts of it that were okay. It was just kind of... The, uh, a oh, file is still in the wait, archive somewhere. What did you guys talk about? Did, did someone cuddle with Alex? No. <laughs> we, we talked about you an the hour, whole time. An hour long. You were replaced by a bag of Doritos. Yes, you were. Oh, there yeah. actually was a bag of Doritos. Your place, I, so we you replaced me with a bag of Doritos? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Fuck all of you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we a, a, An actor of my status. <laughs> <laughs> So what replaced you, what have you by Doritos. Um, and I got, I got a, yeah, day. Uh, I got a Blu-ray player. Wow, wow. and it's fucking awesome. Wow. Two thousand and eight. Yeah, I can't believe that guys have just turned to be it just turned two thousand nine. It's like crazy. <laughs> We're almost the year twenty ten. Fuck you. <laughs> I love how like as soon as you told me about your Blu-ray player, you were like, and I got Jaws. Jaws on Blu-ray. It's like this movie oh, where there's a shark attacking people, <laughs> and it was made today. <laughs> you know, some of those old movies actually look really nice. Like, oh, they when look they, when they digitally remastered. Oh them. yeah, they look beautiful. Yeah. That uh, um, the uh, new Raiders of the Lost Ark they look great, yeah. amazing, and all uh, the, the Alfred the Hitchcock Blu-ray stuff. The yeah, the Blu-ray. Oh, I want to see the IMAX. I, I'm gonna see that uh, Friday. I can't wait to see that. Oh, wow. And uh, I got the Terminator anthology on Blu-ray. Such a good deal. Three or four movies. Four. Uh, Oh, all of them? Okay. Well, the fourth one is... uh, I like four a lot more than three. (laughs) I like three a lot more than four. Three's a terrible movie. I don't think so. Three is a terrible movie. This is where we differ again. It is a terrible movie. The Kyle and Dave differ hour. (laughs) Oh, Jesus Christmas. John Connor is old enough to see what... Like, he's not that young. He's like 15. You know what this kid's going to look like. He does not turn into that guy that's in Terminator 3. Well, honestly, I think he actually looks a little more like Michael Bean. Like, just kind of like a mix between them. I really got Mr. Bean in my head. (laughs) 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 I was like, like, Rowan Atkinson? (laughs) That Wait, is that creepy? What, how do you spell? His, uh, how do you pronounce his name? Bean, right? It's Mike Bean. I don't know who's Michael Bean. Is it the dude in Terminator Three? Oh, that's the dude in the, that's uh, Kyle Reese. In the oh, first one. Oh, the and the one. second one, yeah. Uh, yeah, but but that's not. I I know what you you're talking about. Like, but I didn't I didn't right? mind that. I didn't I didn't mind that. I didn't like. That's him. what I, was, I. didn't think he was a good actor. I didn't think. I think he was movie. all right. I I like. He didn't have the edge like like Kyle Kyle Reese uh, not Kyle Reese John Connor is supposed to be either an ad, a little like bitch or or badass he was neither he was just sort of like well he guy. was in the middle well yeah. he thought it was over to give him his credit he thought it was over he and he didn't have, have to worry it. about it anymore why would you do that I don't know he was just being a dick that's not how time <laughs> travel works <laughs> well he didn't uh, know. we watch Doctor Who so we know how time it works travel bitch. Is they're never experts. Over. Exactly. Travel doesn't exist. I was going to go back to the future, how every time they do something, something yeah. else goes wrong. Yeah. But no, it's 
And the fourth one, it has its moments. I still like it. But I feel like it's not enough John Connor, and it wasn't enough Kyle Reese. Well, they just, just made Sam Worthington the that main was character. That was, was like, weird. Because get him out of there. What the fuck is he doing? I feel like they want. They were like, oh, let's tell a story, but Hollywood won't let us tell a story unless you throw in, like... Sam Worthington. <laughs> yeah, at the time, yeah. Yeah, he was a big uh, star. Avatar, Clash of the Titans. Uh, uh, only one of them was a really big hit, right? Avatar, Avatar. yeah. I liked Clash of the Titans. Parts of Clash of the Titans. Liam Neeson no. and, and Ray Fiennes. Oh, yeah. No, no. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> I will lower it to that. They like look them. like brothers. Yeah. They look like actual brothers Did in that movie. Did you see uh, Wrath of the Titans? No. I was so turned was off good. by Clash of the no. Titans. I was like, the, scared. The, all the Sam Worthington parts suck again, but, but uh, they literally... He's the main character. I, he occupies I, most of the movie. No, a lot, there is a lot of Zeus and Hades in this oh, movie. All right, cool. And they fight together in the end. Oh, they fight together at the end? Like Hades, I would just want to watch that part. It is amazing, because Hades betrays Zeus as normal, whatever. Oh, well, Zeus spoiler. Like, oh, come on. No, <laughs> now I can't watch this movie. Yeah, now I don't want to watch. I just read the Netflix, well, no, dick. I'm going to ruin it. I'm going to ruin it. Is it on Netflix? I'm gonna, I think This is so, not probably. a good enough movie that I, I feel bad in ruining it. But, um, <laughs> Zeus is dying, like oh, like Kronos is sapping all his power. He's literally about to be dust. He's about to be dead. Hades saves him, or they, or... His kid saves him. Whoever, someone yeah, saves him. Fuck that. And like he's like he's like on a bed. He's all white haired and like can barely move. And Hades walks in and basically is apologizes and it's like I'm sorry, I didn't want it to go this way, kind of thing. And like just earlier, Zeus was like, I forgive you for betraying me, all this stuff, whatever. And so Hades like gives him what's left of his power. Yeah. And uh, or or like basically a, enough power to get back. Like they're not uber mega gods anymore, but they're they're still gods. <laughs> And, uh, fuck and and he's just like and Zeus is just like so you want to go end this and he's and Hades like but we don't have like, like we don't have any weapons and he's like we didn't have weapons at the beginning and they just walk out there's like monsters jumping at him and he's just like pimping down the street he's like bitch like <laughs> <laughs> vaporizing them. that's awesome vaporizing them. like like someone just jumps up like Hades just grabs a pitchfork just like sticks it in him like that's, it that is what I want to see it was exactly what you want to see that, that is. It was like an That's hour worth it. and 45 minutes to watch that. Like, <laughs> to get to that. And I, oh, thank God. And I, was just, I really was sort of like, all right, it's kind of worth it for that. <laughs> like, oh, my God. All right, so what's what's up? Who, who else? What's what's up with you guys? I haven't seen you in a while. You had a, you threw a party, right? I saw some pictures. Huh? Huh? You danced? Oh, you went to a party. Oh, yeah, I went to my friend's party on Saturday. Oh, well. <laughs> Party? I wasn't invited to this fucking, fucking party. party. Fuck you. <laughs> what? Oh, sh- 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 Sorry, to say house, but no one loves you anymore. <laughs> except, except Dave. Okay. Dave. Dave will spoon you, but I will, I will is, cuddle with you. He has to be the big spoon. Just remember that. Yeah. <laughs> oh, so I actually have somewhat of a funny thing that I've never, I've never done because I was past that age, like when it start, came to existence. I went to Build a Bear. Yeah, I can't remember when we were like in like, yeah. middle school. I'm like, look, that place <laughs> is genius. <laughs> At, like, I my that is the most one. genius yeah. thing I've ever seen in my entire life. You're making, you're getting kids to pay to make their own stuffed animals. <laughs> you don't need to tie down a Chinese lady. I you. know. <laughs> a poor <laughs> Chinese girl. I like, make a bill bear with one eye. <laughs> I'm gonna make I'm, I'm two hoping, feet. <laughs> I'm gonna open up the same kind of store. Except it's gonna be like you build two. One goes to the like adoption agency for, for kids, and then you sell those ones. Oh shit! Really? <laughs> oh my god! So you have the kids as a workforce for you. Oh my god! And they're paying you. Dude, you fucking take this. Give me my Government, money. Government, where are you? That's fucking they build brilliant. Two, put in the happy-go-lucky basket that goes to kids in need. Oh god! And then it goes to my other store. <laughs> <laughs> All this is where scam. I make my, 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 my drug money. <laughs> <laughs> Do you hide drugs in the building there? Bear. Bear. <laughs> it's not really stuffing for your kids. It's really they did that, that it's just, oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All crystal meth. Yeah. Uh, You're stuffing cotton. The bears go to the guts and the narrows. Huh? Crack cocaine. <laughs> you want some LSD, kids? You want to trip fucking balls and build a bear? Smokey the polar bear. <laughs> Mommy, what's happening? <laughs> Why are there six of you, and why is one of them purple? <laughs> the airs, the bears want to eat me. <laughs> you could probably stick some drugs in a bear, and it would never get found out. Because I've had teddy bears. I've never ripped them apart. Like, yeah, right. 
just kind of a little small those, hole now, and, and you just stuff dog, it in though, there. That dog's getting oh, yeah. fucked up. When you're like, yeah. Oh, like, <laughs> like, that'd be sad. you're a baby and then it starts to get little, like, butt stuff to come out or whatever. What? What are you talking about? <laughs> this is cocaine, not a fucking ribeye. Wait, wait, wait is bear. your bear's ass just all of a sudden <laughs> exploding? <laughs> it it ate? Teddy bear's a hole in it. There's a hole in it. It's like, just like, uh, in its ass? Have you been it. fucking it lately? <laughs> wait, wow. Well, you know, well, I don't like to talk about that. But you're, you're and this is a great segue shit? to uh, Alex's what? joystick. You're still <laughs> well, it was so old, it just got, you know, got worn out. And, like, all, like, the, in its oh, ass. That's not yeah. what I'm... Yeah, that, <laughs> You would figure someplace else. I don't know. That's where it happened. <laughs> I don't know what you've been Alex doing. Alex's finger is there too often. <laughs> Something oh, happens subconsciously. God. But you know what? I don't oh. even notice it. <laughs> like some paranormal this show activity. brings Somebody out the dirtiest in us. Puts a camera in your room. And, oh my God, Alex. You're just <laughs> just seriously <laughs> fisting <laughs> the bear. Alex, stop fisting your bear. For 21 years. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm imagining this now. Go shame, away. This is, this is my closet bear. is just filled with teddy bears that just have giant holes in the asshole. <laughs> 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 Poor bears. Right. Go I'm going to like cry when I go to seven. sleep tonight. Oh. <laughs> Those bears will be able to sleep tonight. <laughs> There's a wanted poster of Alex and every build a bear. Beware of this. Alex's child. <laughs> you see, no, you see Alex. Man child. Like, you see Alex on the security camera at Build a Bear, just every day going and buying like thirty or forty <laughs> teddy bears. <laughs> <laughs> I need these. He has a freaking rewards card. With Build a Bear. Shut up and take my money. <laughs> every twenty bears, he gets one free one. Oh. It needs more stuffing. <laughs> more stuffing. In it. And then after a hundred, he gets the giant one. I like more cushion for the push. These are the stuffing machines. Are fucking, they're like freaking like. Just half the size of this room, like vacuum. Yeah, like it, it's, it's yeah. pretty goddamn smart. <laughs> yeah, I wish Wait, they're still around though. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I wish I was Mr. Bill. Smith Haven Mall is one. I, I didn't know. That I wish they were I think that's around. where I was. Yeah. Wow. So what's so there's, uh, there's Kyle now now Jose. What have you been up to? I flew to Connecticut, but that's about it. Well, you're, Did you're you get cross drunk country? before you flew? But no. Well, why not? You're a fucking pilot. That's exactly why. Ah, oh, damn it. <laughs> Alex, <laughs> I'm sorry I'm being a. I'm sorry that I'm being a productive member of society, Dave. So you're pilot. Like you're supposed to get drunk before ever take being up. drunk while like picking people up in a plane. <laughs> all right, guys, true. that's the not true. At the worst all. thing you can ever do. Yeah, that is not true. I'm sure the people in Aurora, Colorado, really agree with you. Okay. Oh, well, that's I too brought sick. it down. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Go Thanks, there. Dickhead. He had to jump off the bridge. And also, oh, oh, Batman dude. Batman dude. Oh, <laughs> fuck. No, no <laughs> we're not talking about Batman. <laughs> I don't <laughs> actually have <laughs> <not do Batman. laughs> Oh, thank Jesus. I had Christian Bale news, though. Oh, the, yeah. Him visiting that sick kid. Oh, yeah, yeah, I saw that. That yeah. was so cool. That was really cute, yeah. Yeah, I was. I heard about that on a different podcast, and I read about it. I read the article. Some kid was dying of cancer, just wanted to meet Batman. And he, like, not, there's no, like, Cancer, that was related to the aura. Or, uh, no, that, no, that was no, separate. No, that's, that, that's why, like, it's even cooler because he just did something cool. Yeah. Um, <laughs> so he's even, he's cool. He's building up. Um, yeah, he's building but, up. And, cool and like, this wasn't like publicized. He was like, I'm visiting this cancer kid. Just somehow leaked out, like, because the mom's kid, like the the kid's mom. Yeah, they raised money, right? On it. No, no, they just they talked. It was people on Facebook, be, be, like, uh. and he was like, sure, and and came out to went to Disney with him. Went to like the Disney ninety nine club or whatever, like the super exclusive. And he like, paid for everything. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Oh wow. Well, he's Christian and, fucking bail. Probably like make a wish or something. And hung out. No, was just, I mean, it was, I don't think that was his wish. But no, you know, no, it wasn't a make a wish. It was a was, thing. Yeah, it was, he just did it. But that was yeah, it was his own heart. thing. Yeah, yeah it, it wasn't nice, an organization. And then, weird, and then even weirder, like a week later, the kid found out from his doctors his cancer's in remission. Oh wow. And he does not have can't like he's, he's well, he said they said an wow, article I read he might yeah. still. It's still heard, a chance. I heard that he could. I heard there's no cancer in the system right now. Oh my God. Well, that's good. Batman. Batman, Batman saved beat his... cancer. That Jesus <laughs> feels <laughs> sick. And did you hear about uh, that? Uh, the, the actual Make a Wish thing where Ron Perlman actually oh, yeah. went back in the makeup of Hellboy. Yeah, yeah. I, might, I might have not liked those movies, but damn, that's really you know, that's that's pretty cool. Some kids' wake up mission was Hellboy. It's kind of random. Well, no, Dude, the kid's on. favorite superhero was he Hellboy. Was Hellboy. Yeah. He's like six years old. Yeah, it's not, like, 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 fuck you, Alex. Alex is like, Alex <laughs> is like, he's dying, and he has bad taste. That's <laughs> two on my list. <laughs> he should die now. I should <laughs> fist his bear when he dies. <laughs> <laughs> Ha, ha, ha.
Oh, God. <laughs> 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 no, we'll talk about that. <laughs> <laughs> Except now you did care we have a problem. We peaked at 15 minutes. <laughs> Fuck you, Alex. <laughs> Might as well call us quits now. We're never going to get any better. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> Just turn off the podcast. <laughs> it's finished. We're done. Oh. And good night. <laughs> and, uh, well, I, there's only From one. From the ninth circle of hell, everyone. Good night. <laughs> Except now this is the perfect transition for Alex's joystick playground. I just thought we were still talking about this. Yeah. It's transition. We could segue. When the time comes. Uh, you you want him to fix yours, Brad? You weren't even <laughs> segue. You were just dancing. <laughs> That's my <laughs> segue. That does not come to For radio. This is, <laughs> for radio, this is a great segue. <laughs> All right, but fine. We'll do think, Alex's joystick corner. No, for I want to make a comment about that. That was playground. I think you might be wanting to like, uh, re- like, you know, revamp his public image. I feel like that. I don't know of what you? happened. Like his oh, like, oh, screaming. Oh, <laughs> 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 I was like, yeah, you're doing public about. image work right no. now. <laughs> 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 He's whatever, some like, PR people. He's like screaming at people. No. Like, some production. I don't, it was well, one dude, Everyone gave him a lot of shit for that. You know, no, no, one that was like two years ago. No, that was 2009. Yeah, that was three years ago. That was the set of Terminator, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, so that, yeah. That's why I love it even more. <laughs> I, <laughs> Jose is telling Alex to Oh, wow, I'm already, like, pretty close. You have to borderline blow these microphones in order to get your voice through. Wow. <laughs> um, but no, but that, like, like people were done with that. Like, yeah, and that, that, now it's just guy. funny, yeah. Especially uh, really people who just really remember him. I was like, oh, yeah, he's Batman. He's that asshole, like, who well, no, yelled at people no, or whatever. he came on, like, 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 after that happened, he came on the radio, he, on radio show. He get like, there were interviews with him where he was like, yeah, I overreacted. That never should have happened. I was having a bad day. Like, it was, like, he, he was very, like, hu- like, not humble, but he was like, yeah, it happened. Like, I'm sorry, I was an asshole that day. Like, like, it, it, like, he admitted it. It wasn't yeah, like he was... I mean, and I love how people like blow it out of proportion. Like, oh my god, Trisha Bell is such an asshole. Why would you want to work with that guy? That you was know? funny. But anyway, <laughs> no, that's another thing that I didn't hate that I hated about uh, Salvation. It's that he was just trying to be Batman. Like he was doing his John Connor was doing his worst Batman impression. Well, this is John <laughs> Connor. <laughs> I found the term. Get to the chopper. <laughs> um, we gotta get calories. I'm out of breath. <laughs> I um, lost my. I, I think. I, I mean, if you're in that situation, uh, like John Connor probably was a big Batman fan. <laughs> <laughs> like, uh, like, like during the apocalypse. No, because like, like you're raised, saved you're, up you're his raised your whole life. Like you have to be the savior of the world. He was also a kid of the of like the the ni- the eighties and nineties. It's true, he but was he definitely read Batman. Yeah, but he didn't no. know that Christian Bale was voicing the voice. No, but well, uh, yeah, but but in this hypothetical <laughs> universe, Christian Bale probably did do Batman. Yeah, he probably did. And. This is way in the future, so that was probably big. They were, they were big movies. The yeah, Dark Knight yeah, yeah. was like the biggest movie ever. I guess. Yeah. So he was, uh, he was John Connor was probably like, wow, that's weird how much that guy looks like me. But <laughs> <laughs> we could be twins. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, it was bizarre. So he, he could probably be was my like, father. To, he was probably like, I have to be the guy now. Everyone has to look up to me. Who does everyone look up to? And then he turns and he looks Batman. at a Dark Knight poster and he's like, Batman. Batman. <laughs> The poster's on his wall. He's a 35 year old man, <laughs> leader of the resistance. And he's got a Batman poster on the wall. This is who I look up to. My God. <laughs> well, what was the year in the Terminator Term universe that uh, was it? Judgment Day. Yeah, Judgment Day uh, happened. It was, it was 2003. Was, oh, okay. Yeah, so it was. It was. Yeah, so it was past. That's why, so yeah, that's why Batman. Came out. Yeah. Okay. So it happened in the eighties, and maybe he didn't read Batman or something. Well, that's what you know. The first well, movie came out, and it was out. like you know, it was it was time. It was like there were 20 years to. Yeah. Anyway, so back to Alex's joystick corner. Want to do the jingle? Yeah, I did, but... Do what's it. the jingle? It needs to be spontaneous. All right. Do it's it! Hideous. No, talk about something else. I'll just interrupt. And then we'll, yeah, we'll just throw a... Right. Throw well, that's that. just obnoxious What's new with the, uh, Dave? Dave, say something. Well, what? <laughs> well, we well, he I, did. Did. I already did my thing. I got a Blu-ray player. I'm living in like, oh, eight. I have a question. Things. You dick. Up to the, the Kickstarter you were doing, like I was gonna donate, and like it was uh, canceled. Yeah, that's a big long. Story. Alex's joystick <laughs> corner, <laughs> where little kids love to play. Alex likes to fist up bears and hang out with the little boys. <laughs> Bring his joystick, everybody. <laughs> Even analog sticks are okay too. <laughs> Alex likes to push buttons, especially in the asshole. All right, that went way too far. That went way too far. That went a little, little yeah, right. well, I am not. You have to be like, like liter- literate about that. He likes to hit the Z button. Oh, no. <laughs> oh. All right. You have to I'm going to go to the bathroom now and throw up. <laughs> right. Well, well this I kind of want to cry Alex right now. Alex's joystick corner.
Sorry. Which one is it? Make up your mind. Uh, it's corner. the same thing. They're, they're the same thing. Yeah, okay. I don't know. Yeah, I think it's creepier if it's a corner. Like, little kids, like, in the back alley. Alex's joyst- Alex right. joystick back this alley is, against the a, dumpster. This is a j- just casting exclusive. Uh, first time exclusive right here. I don't know about that because the internet's pretty big. So, the inter- uh, Nintendo announces a Wii U price and release date apparently today. The fuck? Yes. It's uh, what? September and it's coming out. Uh, hold on, what is it? I don't even know. Speaking to the mic, dipshit. Oh, I'm looking at the website. They'll officially announce a. Pr- oh, it will announce the price and release date for the Wii U tomorrow during a presentation in Japan. It's probably gonna be a, a Nintendo Direct because they do that. I think every month they have a little like um little like web show where they like show off. Games or they're gonna come out and stuff. Oh, that's probably when they're gonna do it. So, so we really don't have any exclusive nope, at all. No, it's just an announcement for an announcement. I thought it was the actual announcement. I revoked my jingle. I didn't know you could do time. that. How, how can you do that? Uh, it's called you edit it out. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's no fun. You can edit out the asshole part and it'd be okay. <laughs> I think that was the best part. Okay. Um, everyone knows Zynga. The people who uh, make the farm builds and the city Fuck builds. Fuck those jackasses. Oh, is that what the, I didn't know who that was. Yeah, that's sure. Zynga. They make those Facebook games. But, you know, they like to rip off things. But now they think <laughs> they continue their stride. And they make a Pokemon-style game. And, like, just look at... If you just see this picture, they look like Pokemon. I mean, like, one looks like, almost like Bulbasaur. Oh, come on. They're not, even, they're not even trying. One looks like a Pikachu slash, like, fire Pokemon hybrid. What the, the other fuck? one looks like a Mareep slash Pidgey hybrid. <laughs> like, literally. Like, if you just see this picture, you know exactly what I'm talking about. I'm looking at it right now, and all I can say give, is this is... Give a is link for people to go on if they want to look it up. Well, yeah, I guess... It's on the, on, uh, he's looking uh, at GameSpot.com. In the, in the, in the uh, description, I'll, in the, when I upload the video, the podcast, I'll well, put I it know. up there. Yeah, but just say it. Just to well, I'm, I'm not going to read the whole URL. It's the long one. <laughs> Gamestop.com slash news slash What's the Zynga name dash. of the thing? Zynga releases Pokemon style game. Oh, That's the name of the, uh, the article. article. And it's called uh, Monotopia. Interesting. Montopia. Asking players to collect them all. Not catch them all. Collect them all. Well, catching is aggressive and mean. Yeah, right. They have to collect them all and level them up. So there you go. There's Zynga being, you know, they're... Usual cells. Well, wait. When did they copy? Yeah, the uh, when did they too. copy stuff before? I, don't know. I, don't, I didn't know Farm farms. Bill, farms are Harvest not public Moon. domain. <laughs> okay. Uh, That's not. He said this. They said this. Sim fir- City. So, so uh, what I was is say, this? Farms are New farms Pokemon? are real, Alex. Um, <laughs> Sim City is owned by the people who make the Sim. It's owned by EA. Yeah. Oh, so. EA. Ooh. so it's not a ripoff. It's owned by the same today. company. Bazinga was yeah, bought by EA before. Get the fuck out of After they made that game. It's Mer- still EA. Yeah, but they were bought by EA it's... after they made Cityville. So, no, no. So, wait, so wait a minute. So the same Pokemon game. They look just like Pokemon. Look at it. Bulbasaur. You can see Fire Pikachu. It's not, it's not a Pokemon game. That's the problem. It's not. Yeah, it's, it's, it's people who make the Facebook games. Like people who make Farmville. Look at that. It looks like fucking Bulbasaur. Yeah, but it doesn't look like... What the fuck is this? Mari. Is this like some weird American <laughs> ripoff thing? Yeah, what is this? It's, it's Essentially. The, it's from Sweden or something? <laughs> it's a Facebook game. It's actually very Swedish. Uh, yeah. Is that like supposed to be Jigglypuff oh my right God, there? Even have it in, like, the, the, yeah, the, the, the font. font. The font. Yeah. yeah, right. Wow, guys, good job. Yeah, Zynga, not even trying. Zynga's reputation as a copycat studio won't be reversed with the release of its newest game. <laughs> yeah, right. So, so this is gonna be on Facebook. Yeah. Yeah. Facebook game. Well, it's a, oh, wait. <laughs> well, you know what? I'm sorry. They got no, me wait, no, 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 no. Nintendo should have teamed up with Facebook because Pokemon this is game, an easy enough game. It's you actually can put the old games on Facebook. You it's actually available to you for iOS actually, and Android. That's a pretty good idea. Huh? Yeah, that that's Nintendo's loss. You can you can play this on Android and they iOS. They probably do the same, they probably make a lot of money. They also teamed up with Apple. No. Oh, of course. No, I mean they uh, would. But. I mean, you, yeah, you make if you, if you, you know. release like Pokemon Silver, Gold, Dude, like you can release red, NES those. and Game Boy games on the damn iPhone. It will sell like there's no fucking tomorrow. Oh, yeah, but you could still Pokemon, get it off the really Facebook need... app, right? If you still go on Facebook, you can still download that anyway. Yeah, and you Wait, still so have to pay Pokemon, for it. Pokemon, Dude. Yeah, yeah, Pokemon. Say if it's po- say Nintendo oh, put oh, Pokemon oh, through right. Facebook and they had its own game, they, they you said, still have to buy it. Like I think you were saying like Facebook. Oh, no, no, no. They verbally came out and said they're not releasing, they're only releasing Nintendo games on Nintendo hardware. 
Except Such for like a bad decision. they released a Pokédex on the iOS. That was the only release they ever had that was not on a, a Nintendo platform. Hey Jose, can I uh, ask you a question? Sure. Why is there a pencil in the soundboard? I don't know. I put it there for the hell of it. Okay. <laughs> Short everything out, like break everything. But that's it's not gonna do anything. <laughs> Anybody have pencils fallout? can conduct electricity. Fallout. Anybody Fallout? No. You're no one nah. really cares. The only one. There, there was a teaser for Fallout Four, but. Uh-huh. Oh really? Yeah. Can we can we talk about something we all care about, Alex? There's nothing. <laughs> this has got to be Batman. something. Okay. Sony. No, no more Batman. Batman. Sony. 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 Batman. Sony. Aquaman. Oh, actually, I do have something to say about Batman, but it's not directly Batman. All right. What is Did it? you see the robot? Not an Alex's DC playground DC corner. DC special. Oh, no. Oh, it was really funny. Yeah. The joystick really corner funny. is over. Put it away. No, yeah. joystick corner. Alex I'm still in my playground right now. The playground is open. <laughs> it's open. Kids business. are still coming. There's a line right there. I'm still accepting kids, okay? And they were all crying. <laughs> <laughs> we got complaints. They have their joysticks in their hands. And they want to we play got complaints from several parents for children claiming they were being used as teddy bears. Oh. I'm leaving it at I don't that. know what that means. <laughs> they also, there's also some with teddy bears, so it's still going to go on. So, Sony is... Um, like a few months ago, they brought out like this uh, virtual reality 3D headset they showed off. Oh, I saw that, yeah. And now they're they're, they're bringing uh, an updated ver- version to the Tokyo Game Show. They should not do that. Whenever they do a virtual reality thing, it's like the weakest shit ever. Well, like it's so slow. There's only been the Virtual bullshit. Boy. Well, Virtual Boy was not. A that thing. doesn't count. <laughs> that, <laughs> that was that was the, that was like the only legitimate release of anything virtual reality that was well, like no, they legitimate. Always legitimate. Demo somewhere. Well, the only thing <laughs> that made it legitimate was Nintendo. Yeah. So. Yeah, yeah. And. Besides this Sony headset, there there is talking about Kickstarter. There is another Kickstarter like similar to the Ouya, but it's not the same company. They're releasing a, a 3D virtual headset that will work with your PC, uh, lag free. That's a pretty. They use your move movements as like the, uh, you know, to look around as a right. I believe it when stick. I see it. Agreed. Well, apparently, like, like it, it's 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 supported by all these like major like video game. Uh, companies developers. and developers are like, yeah, this thing really works. It's not like a host, a, ho- a hoax or anything. Well, it's, I'm it's not really saying it's a hoax. I'm just yeah, saying. Yeah, well, no, it's no. not. They said that the biggest he's just problem. He's not going to invest this money. Yeah, but they said the biggest problem in the past with virtual reality was always the uh, the delay where you have and that ruins that ruins everything. So they said this yeah. is this is like late, late and free. It's going to be like natural almost. Like they said, they, they didn't realize they were like playing games. That's what they said. So I don't know. Bull. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> you never know until you see yourself. I hope it's true. I mean, oh, I mean, yeah. I, I hope it's I true. I don't know if I would get it even if it was perfect. I'm, I'm taking it as a grain of salt. Apparently yeah. it's perfect. So, oh a like, giant grain of salt. No, a giant grain of salt. <laughs> <laughs> salt mine. <laughs> <laughs> That's what? right, Lola. It is bullshit. Are you talking to your bird? <laughs> Fuck yes. Is Jose gone fucking nuts <laughs> since I last saw him? <laughs> Hello. Hello, my little ones. Dance for me. <laughs> uh, Your roommate to... comes in. What are you doing? Uh, I'm <laughs> making them dance. They're dancing. <laughs> They're dancing. Minus, Dance for me, Jim. <laughs> minus, <laughs> minus the roommate part, I did used to do that when I was 14. Shit. You used to make a bird's dance? 14 was not the right age to say. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's like... <laughs> you think at 14 you used to make your gay friend dance? No. <laughs> <laughs> Dance oh. game, man. Dance! <laughs> <laughs> I made the birds dance, you asshole. Uh, well, you said gym dance. So I don't know which one you're referring to. Just casually, there's nothing against At homosexuals. 14, Please do not just, just take anything we're about to say. <laughs> that was not even homophobic. It was just weird. Yeah. <laughs> dance, stupid dance. Uh, All right, besides that, one more thing. I think, it, like, I think everyone can – everyone's been – like, watched G4 before. Oh, right? my God, yeah. yeah. I actually forgot did about you, this and wanted to did, talk Did you this. see this? Yeah, is it even – all right, well, yeah, we'll preface it by saying G4, the home of everything nerdy on TV, is basically going away. I, are they going to call but it G4 But what's there anymore? left to G4? Like, like, all right. Wait, so G4 has, like, their bare-bones programs now. They have, they have X-Play and a- uh, Attack of the Show, which is their only two original programs. And then it's cops, They're cheaters. Gonna, cops, uh, cheaters, cops. They do it because that's what makes money. That's what <laughs> yeah. it says, uh, sells ad. But that's it. This, like, like, that's their only two shows they show is cops, cheaters, and maybe yeah. maybe some move, random 80s like, movie like, or something. Yeah, it's a lot of, like, <laughs> uh, the, the uh, Toxic Avenger and, like, like, uh, like uh, kung fu movies. And, like, yeah. really well, that's kind of cool. But you can't really find Toxic Avenger anywhere besides that. But it's, it's too often. That. Like, they only play oh, the same. Oh, it's too often. Like, wow. 
Like, honestly, the people say, including me, like, G4 has gone downhill ever since. But I still love a, a, a Attack of Yeah, I know. I like, it, well, it I'm pretty sure show. it's going downhill because, like, they don't have to watch anything. They just go well, on, I don't know, like, IGN like, or some other movie site or game site and just get it off of it. But they're way better because they get the people. Like, they get the real people that are, like, Yeah, but I guess so, people. but still. Not anymore. Some, uh, everyone is an actor on that like, show. Everyone has a paid opinion. Uh, I don't know about that. Yeah, yeah a lot of well, people. I heard it. Uh, no, but I the bet, only like, I they have, like real people. genuine like people, someone who's in the like the nerd community, like a gamer, Matt Adam Myra. Sessler, Kevin and Pereira, they both left. Matt Myra is on Tag of the Show, and I know for a fact he's a nerd. Okay, well maybe that's a giant. All right, nerd. but, but <laughs> still, everyone else. Was but, like, but yeah, but Kevin I know Pereira leaving to... was the death of that. Yeah, yeah Adam Sessler tell. left. I was like, okay, didn't this, they have like there's really no point. Yeah, she left too though. But she was no, not like she was no living in Mon. But she, she came not, out, yeah, as she, saying like, "No, I was paid to do this." Yeah, or right. Whatever, she was, blah, like, blah, I didn't blah. wait for a second. She was but like, "But to be you know, fair, she was paid and she didn't really want to do it, but she did it for a long time." Yeah, a long time. She was a mom. She, she played along, like so. I give her credit for that. Yeah, but, yeah, but she paid along for the paycheck. <laughs> yeah, but she play, played along, and she was like pretty cool about it. Uh, but I hear the people on it now are are at least nice and like for like like they're not like bitches about it. Huh. Yeah, but well. the, like the, the only like the only credibility that that the whole channel had was basically like those two people, like Adam was, Sessler yeah. and then Kevin like Kevin the whole Pereira. channel. Yeah, like be, with him leaving, like it, like their whole credibility is just it's there's no yeah. point of watching it anymore. Like so really. now it's they so were looking for a new leaving? host for a while. Like it was a lot of like Chris Hardwick. Of the yep. nerdist was was like like they thought about bringing him in full time, but he's got like you know, he, he has still, a whole empire. To does, run. does he still do like AOTS back to the show? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's they, still they, on they, it? They've been having guests. Oh no, he doesn't. No, no, he doesn't do not for anymore? a long time. He yeah. was doing Gadget Prom, and then now Matt Myra does Gadget. Okay, Prom. so wait, but so it's just leaving the show. It's gonna be the, no, the, the style, network like, is gonna be because they're, they're, they're owned by E. Like they're owned by the they're owned by NBC. Yeah. Yeah. They're owned by NBC. Yeah, well, yeah, which owns all of the. Yeah, all those networks, and they're basically putting more like E and Style Channel shit like on there. It's basically MTV syndrome it's going through, which is like everything. Like, like a channel that comes out. Like, so no more video games, just no, yeah. Kardashians. It's like, it has oh. been that way for no, it's not even gonna be. I don't think it's gonna be called G4. They're gonna change the name. G4 refers to games. Uh, um, Forever gadgets, games, something. gadgets, girls, and something. I can't remember. You, what it was. Yeah, and I think guns for cops. Like I think that was the. Cops. It used to be something when, when the channel was old video games. It used to stand for something else. But I forgot. Like it was well, old no, it was, video games. It was games. like E three G four. Yeah, which doesn't make sense. But like, like the, the channel did lose credibility once it changed. When when, when they started pulling out all like the game, like, like the, the channel used to be all games all the time. Like MTV used yeah, to be yeah, all music all the time. Yeah. If I remember, it was, you know, back in the day when there was like, uh, um, there was like a cheat a cheat code ga- show. I think there was like there like there's a bunch of video game shows. There were there was like uh, Judgment Day. There was a whole bunch of like they even cool had shows. like Code Breakers that like weird little like animated series. Do you remember yeah. that? Yeah, yeah. It was it was like Code Breakers. Yeah, yeah, it was like that an eight bit yeah, show. Like five, Jesus, fuck, I'm four years again. ago. That was interesting. Mm-hmm. I mean, it wasn't good, but it was like yeah, it was in the genre. It was it was interesting. It was like fun to watch. Yeah, but now it's just you know cops, cheaters, cops. I, yeah, I've heard them talk. It's just hard to sell that space, which but I. It, I, I I was like I feel like they. But what, what it's the, because the real the real reason you want to know why because it's exactly what Dave said. It's the people that would watch that channel are way smarter than to need to watch TV. They watch everything online. That's what I I barely. Watch I would TV. be surprised if G four yeah. comes back on the internet. Like their whole website and everything. Like like not like the, the not the G four website but a G four like all like if, if Attack of the Show runs as a web series. Oh, yeah. I mean, it might that. it might have to go uh, to a different name or something. What, what, what like, direction do they want to go in? It's like are they do are they just want to do all cops, all cheaters? No, all it's day? going to style. It's it's basically becoming like another style network. I heard them. I heard. This, I was reading this article. Style network. Like it's all mean? about it's going to be about fashion and stuff. Oh my god! It's well, like we need another one of those. Like we yeah. have like fifteen million of those already. We have <laughs> come on. But it, it, but it's like I said, we don't need a nerd no one's going to go to nerds. It. Don't really they're, watch TV. I'm like I'm going to be laughing at them when they become bankrupt and they're just going to go out there completely because nobody's going to want to watch it. No one's going to know what it is. But it's easier. But that there's a reason why cops. And cheaters were on. They were the wo- they were the ones that got ratings. G four didn't get ratings. So you're saying like the most rated shows on that channel are cops and cheaters? Yeah. Well, well, that's surprising because that's all that's on. I heard Kevin Pereira. <laughs> no, I heard Kevin Pereira talking about this. Is they had to put that on because that's the only that's how they got ad time. That's how people paid for advertising was to be on during cop because they're like they're the massively high rated shows on that network. 
But do they need it? Still? Yes. They would not. They they. That's why they're they would have went video bankrupt. Game shows. They did it. Yeah, they were they were going bankrupt. Like that's why they had to only put on like sixteen hours of Cops and Cheaters and you know eight hours of Attack of the Show reruns and an episode of X Play. Like because that was what makes money. Like the middle of the country doesn't want to watch. You know, guest star Gene Rod. Well, Gene Roddenberry's dead, but like Gene Roddenberry's son talking about a Star Trek DVD. Like they don't care about that. But they already have like like a number of those channels that that, that, that cater to those kind of people, which is like basically most of the <laughs> population of like you know dumb rednecks. But whatever, you know. <laughs> yeah, but that's but that's. Well, what's what are out, you saying? Man? That's what. <laughs> I'm saying. If, if you I, I can't show, watch Cops the, and Cheaters. You know. Fuck you. <laughs> oh, those shows can be entertaining at times, but like you know, like fifteen episode marathons of each show each day is just not you know. It's yeah, not it's like I want to watch what I came here to watch and not this. I could go to True yeah. TV and watch this, but so, which but you like, could. You G- could go on True TV. G- and watch G- that. was like the World's only dumbest. channel on TV who, that did what they did. Was like the the only all time nerd that, video game and that whatever shows show. You, that shows you what the the market says. They don't want that. Because no, no, nothing know. gets taken off the air if it's doing well. Nothing, ever. Yeah. That's never once happened. Like, that, it, it was not doing well. People don't watch it because we're on the internet. We're getting all our news before they are. Hmm. Or b- at least before we see them. Like, the only thing. Well, even, know, like, even all those shows weren't about news. They are about, like, the, the, they have some pretty different concepts to each of those shows they had, those video game not shows. Really? They weren't about news or anything. They were about, like, you know, like, like, like each show had a featured game and they would do something talk about that game or like but you can find that on the internet yeah but you can you can find like whatever like fashion shows on pretty much any any channel but besides people that go so. on but people that's the thing there's more of them watching tv than there is of us because we, we're just going to go on the internet and find everything we need everything we ever need to know about whatever we want that's true i don't know like that's, that's if, if g4 is really getting those ratings that you say they are then whatever good for them then but i don't think they really are <laughs> well no that's what i'm saying is it's a they're not doing good. That's the problem. So even with the cops and cheaters, they're, like they're they were, still that, not doing good. That's how good. they were staying alive. Like that's how they were paying to keep the shows running. They're two original programs. It's the only two they yes! have. Yes. <laughs> that, that run for like an hour and a half. Yeah. Out of twenty-four hours. Yeah, I heard Kevin Burr talking about this. Oh my god, I know that makes sense though. And he basically was the network. He like was running it as like a producer, not just. But now the yeah, ATS. like yes. You know, it, with him gone and Adam Sussman, I, I just don't care anymore. Really. Like, they can do whatever they want. Because, like, I'm, I'm not going to watch it anyway. Like, I, ha- I haven't watched, like, X Play and Attack on a show in, like, uh, years anyway. They've been good. Yeah. I, 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 like, I don't know. I don't know. I, I haven't watched X Play in a long time, but. All right, shall we move on? I guess. Do you have yeah. anything to talk about? I have some news that I've been looking up through IGN. And is anybody excited for Dread 3D? No. Nope. Really? I, I'm, I'm a little bit. It looks all right. I don't like I it. I just, yeah. Hey, what? it's not like that. I don't like It kind of was. <laughs> oh, well, no, not this one. Oh, oh. <laughs> Clearly, I was making fun of the old one. No, block. no, that was totally like that. <laughs> Is that, that, that guy with the helmet minus yeah, like, yeah, the yeah. Power Ranger Judge helmet Red. minus like the bottom part of it? <laughs> Britain's superhero. They gave it an eight. Uh, it, IGN really? it just, gave it an eight. I saw and, it. Uh, um, it looks nothing but like like an 80s style buff. Action. Well, no, it, it doesn't a, say that. it doesn't say it at a all. A mixture like, of that and the comic book movie, which is what it's supposed to be. Really, like Judge, uh, well, Judge Dredd is a Judge Dredd really, is an asshole. It's a, it's a <laughs> super gritty uh, comic book. He's is, like super cop, super cop okay. asshole. Yeah, except he shoots people. All yeah, right, like, but what is it? But it's like even on uh, Rotten people? Tomatoes, it's like a ninety. And, like everywhere, like, it's really? getting good. It looks good, but I just don't like how the city looks. It doesn't look. I don't really how I thought it should look. Like, it's weird. Like I thought the old Judge Dredd looked, the city looked more okay. like how the city should <laughs> Please, look. Let's not even talk. But it was just like <laughs> no, I'm not saying I'm not saying no. I'm not saying, <laughs> no. I'm not saying, <laughs> oh. right now. I'm not, actually, um, I like how in this one he never takes off his helmet. Yeah, because that's what's supposed to happen. Yeah, but I, I heard so you, I was, don't, you know what he looks like. I was, no, no, that's no, the point. But that, but oh, really? In, in the comic, he, he, never, he never takes off his helmet. Yeah, okay. but in, in apparently Stallone didn't want to either. And the, the studio was just like, you're Sylvester Stallone. You have to take off the helmet, like, immediately so people can tell it's you. Uh, uh, <laughs> sell our movie because you're Sylvester Stallone. If I was Stallone. Stallone, I'd just be like, I, I think they'll know it's me. What's his, <laughs> what's his, uh, what's his name? What, the main character in Dread? His name? The actor? What's his name? Oh, Carl Urban. Yeah, Carl Urban, like, refused, like, I'll do it. But I don't want, I don't want to take off the helmet. Yeah, I'm never, yeah. Yeah, he's like, and they're like, really? Like, 
Yeah. That's strange oh, okay. for an actor to say, like, I don't want to see anybody see my well, face. Well, no, because <laughs> no, his claws <laughs> is to stay true to the character. I know, but that, but, like... And he likes the character. He actually knows if, if the they want, book. If they want their career to go off, like, they need to well, get Carl their face Urban's out doing there. All right. Yeah, he's oh, is he uh, already he's an established actor? Okay. He's, he's in is he already J. J. established? Abrams, uh, okay. Uh, Star Trek Two. No, but they have, like, a clause for, like, actors in, like, the superhero roles that they have. They need face time. Yeah. Like Iron Man, uh, Robert Downey Jr. has that clause. But he wanted that. He didn't want to be in the suit. He he. he, he well, no, no, no. He refused to be in the suit more for more than fifteen minutes. Yeah, but that's Robert Downey Jr. said that's that? part of the contract. Yeah. Isn't? Yeah. And the same thing with it's, Captain it's America. Difficult. Like it's a lot of like. Oh, oh, yeah. him in the suit, yeah. personally. Okay, well, like, like most uh, of the suit. Wait, they actually put him. In, they actually put him in the suit. Yeah, this is a real suit. They actually put him in the suit, not like a stunt guy or some shit. No, I mean, no, well, no, for like a certain amount of time, he's really? in the suit because like it has to open and just. Oh well, besides face. those parts, okay, yeah. Well, yeah, that makes sense. So but. a lot of uh, most of it is CGI in the Avengers, but in, in Iron Man, most of it's him. Other it's, than like, unless he's like in moving the and like you okay, know, well, and doing stuff. Like. Obviously. <laughs> And uh, what do you think about the Star Trek title and the villain reveal? Wait, what's the Star Trek? I didn't see this. What's the title? Uh, Star Trek Into Darkness. Oh. Yeah. I mean, it, wait, is that wait? Is it like a Star Trek Into Darkness? Because Trek means like long walk, like Star Trek, and then colon. seven colon. Oh god. I know, but like it, like a Trek Into Darkness. No. <laughs> it's like, Star. It, that's not what they're going for. The, it, it, is the title a Star Trek Into Darkness? Like. <laughs> No, it's that's that's the title. Wait, who, at who, least so who's far. Who's Benedict Cumberbatch playing? Gary Mitchell. Is that a well-known person? He was in. Wait, wait. He's a Vulcan named Gary. He was probably Gary in Deep Mitchell? Space Nine, and no one Or is it the actor? <laughs> no, no. That's no. There's a guy, a villain in the original Star Trek named Gary Mitchell, who was like the first foe that Kirk went up against. Oh my God! Wait a second. Yeah. Yeah, there I was a two-part. Oh gee. Yeah, and that's. Uh, uh, Carl Urban, who plays Bones, yeah. kind of gave it away in an interview. Like, oh, Wait, I can't. Who's Benedict Cumberbatch playing? That's yeah, Gary Mitchell. Oh, he's yeah. a Vulcan. I don't think he's a Vulcan. Because they show him in, uh, they should show him pictures of him, and he's he has the ears. Well, maybe he's a Vulcan, and they made him Gary Mitchell. I don't know because that's what. That is a silly name for a Vulcan. Because <laughs> that's what I don't think so. <laughs> if that's if that's the thing, then I don't think so. But Urban's like, oh yeah, I, I think he's gonna make a great Mitchell, and then everyone's like, oh. Gary Mitchell from the old show, so they put it together. <laughs> and Carl Urban was like, huh? Oh, yeah. no. yeah, wh- what? 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 This wasn't out? No, no. <laughs> JJ, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> so sorry. Suck your and dick. JJ Abrams, the terrible robots, came out and killed him. The Asian? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I suck your dick. Oh, speaking of JJ Abrams, did you hear about his new show? No. He's uh, producing a TV show about a Revolution? cop and his... No, another uh, one. Oh, no. JJ Abrams can't. Yeah. Yeah. He has to have 16 projects going. Yeah, I know. Right? Um, you, you can handle all that shit? No. Good for him. <laughs> no. 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 He, an LA he drops TV cop in the future with his robot partner. Oh, God. It sounds yeah. so cool. Really? I'd but, rather take Dread 3D. But it's like a series I'd rather take the original <laughs> Dread <laughs> in 3D. How does that not entice you? That, that like, doesn't entice J.J. Abrams doing it? We're just going to have to differ. J.J. Abrams doing it. <laughs> yeah, but he's going to about... executive produce. He'll just give the money and it's like, yeah, Do whatever off. you like, yeah. everybody. He's not gonna be like creative about it. No, but but is, but he backs stuff that is generally good. Yeah, backing mm, it and like creating it's a difference. When? Not all the time. What? Flash forward. Cloverfield. I heard that was alright. I didn't think. I heard that was <laughs> Cloverfield is like, no, fuck no, you. No, I agree. Yeah, Cloverfield sucked. I hate <laughs> all of you. Cloverfield was terrible. <laughs> I mean, I like that. Go drown yourself in your Dr Pepper, Dave. One that's like Cloverfield so fucking good. No, that's not saying it's so fucking good, but it's really good. No, I really enjoy it. It's an homage to the to the monster movies of old. No, it's not. It's I'm not terrible. saying that. Did I ever say that? You Jose, did, did I ever say that? You said that with your eyes. I played the yeah, fifth. Right. Well, that's what he's speaking for the for people like I'm, you. I'm speaking for the internet. <laughs> yeah, I'm not a fucking hipster. No, you're not. You're. you're I like Cloverfield before it was cool, before it was even a thought. It was never cool though. Fuck you guys. It was. Yeah, <laughs> I, I really didn't like. It was cool, that. like the month it was out. I, I I didn't realize that. Um, what's his name? It's the best thing in January, I'll tell you that. <laughs> uh, I forget. Well, I, I, the guy who plays HUD or whatever, the, the guy who's holding the yeah. camera. Uh, that was yeah. an interesting is, name. Is, a, is, a, is actually a really funny comedian. Yeah, he's yeah. alright. He's a comedian. Um, yeah, he, he, he's <laughs> he's a in comedian. Yogi Bear, which is weird to be like, that's the movie I'm pulling him from. Or, and also, he's in uh, She's Out of Your League. But I can't remember. He, it, whatever. In real life, he's really super funny. But <laughs> um, he was telling the story of why he went out to be in, in Yogi Bear. And he was basically like... He was just like uh, he, he he just thought it'd be funny to, to audition for Yogi Bear, and he went there and he bought like a real Rangers hat, and he came in and he was just like, 
Oh, uh, he, he asked everyone. He was like, "I just want to, I just want to know if this is okay to wear this hat." I don't, I know, I realize no one, everyone else didn't have the chance to go out and buy a Rangers hat, so I don't want it to be unfair. If you like, he was just doing this whole like thing. They didn't really know what was going on, <laughs> so he did it, and then you got the part. No, he got, he got a call back. He got a call back, and then he thought it would be funny to send in an audition tape, another audition tape. Except reading his lines with a real grizzly bear, like a <laughs> grizzly bear. A real grizzly. Oh, I heard about this. Yeah. You could see it online, of him literally doing like the the Yogi Bear dialogue with a grizzly bear. Oh my lord! <laughs> like, oh my god! And he got the part off that. And, he was, and <laughs> All right. he was like, he was like, I thought the ultimate joke, the ultimate way to end this joke is to do the movie. Because <laughs> 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 everyone online was like, you're a fucking sellout. You're a comedian. You're go like. Gonna, Gonna be a Yogi Bear. <laughs> so he was like, I guess the ultimate fuck you to these people would be like, Yeah, I'm gonna be a Yogi Bear. <laughs> and this nice. is how. All right, so Marvel, talking about Marvel now, we got three big mo- Iron Man 3, mm-hmm. which they are hinting at something called the Patriot. Oh, As Iron Patriot. Some- in it. Yeah, Iron something. Yeah, yeah. Iron Patriot. Well, who is, I don't know who that is. Uh, it's not what the real Iron Patriot is. Okay. Because the real Iron Patriot is the Green Goblin. Okay. Uh, the real Iron Patriot is Norman Osborn takes over Shield, or mm-hmm. Hammer. He renames it. Yeah. And he, uh, I think, I think uh, Captain America's dead at this point. Uh, yeah, this is post Civil War. So, so this is gonna be. So he's dead. Weird. And Iron, no, no, this yeah, is not what's going on at all in the, in, in the movie. This is what went on in the comics to the Iron Patriot. So who? So Captain America died in Civil War. Yeah, I know that. Um, Spoilers. Uh, Iron Man. It was like disappeared yeah. at the end, and he was kind of like it is revealed he was like crazy or something. Yeah, and so basically, you know, there's a, a big vacuum. I think Thor was dead too. I don't know. Thor no, was yeah, dead. Thor was. Thor dead. was an Asgard or dead or something. No, he was dead. I remember because um, they like robot cloned him or something. Well, no, he was no, but he comes. They back robot and, cloned him. <laughs> he comes back at the end of Civil War, uh, whatever it is. Yes, yeah, I true. love when Hercules kills the robot clone. Yeah, he literally was like, I'm. Uh, Thor, the Odin son is my friend. And just like punches You're not a hole. Thor? Yeah, and like punches Damn. a hole in his head. Like, um, whatever. And and so somehow, after all, like like the Nick Fury and the Tony Stark, people were mistrusting them. And somehow Norman Osborn had built himself up to be like a reformed man. And they somehow put him in charge. And everyone in the superhero community is just like, no. And probably in the supervillain community, we're just like, are you kidding me? He's crazy. He puts on green makeup and flies around killing people. And doesn't he attack uh, Asgard? Like, uh, that's later. But um, but he's still in charge of Shield. He, he creates that. an Avengers. The Dark Avengers. That, that he doesn't call them that. That'd be pretty leading. Like. <laughs> No, he's like, these are the Dark Avengers. Trust they're, them with your lives. They're, they're the Avengers. The Dark Avengers. <laughs> um, but, Small uh, yeah, quotation basically marks. Basically, like, a new Spider-Man ends up coming around. It's Venom. They just changed the, he's Like, Norman yeah. Osborn gave him some kind of pill or something to make him hold this for him. Mm-hmm. Uh, Ares is there instead of Thor. Moon Knight. Or not Moon Knight. Um, What's uh, Moon Knight? Moonstone, Moonstone becomes the new uh, Ms. Marvel. Um. Bull, uh, Bullseye becomes Hawkeye. Yeah, okay, but like with the Iron Patriot, so uh, he just he like they, they're out, and he realizes nobody they 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 just look like a team of, of, of superpower people. They're just, they're not really earning the people's trust. He realized what was missing. Oh, was so he has to yeah. Iron Man and Captain America. Okay, so he takes one of Tony's suits because he inherited all like, yeah all the all stuff. stuff when he fought out Stark whatever it was, and he literally takes an Iron Man suit and paints it Captain America colors. Yeah. And he's like, I'm the Iron Patriot. <laughs> like, All right, then. So I guess – oh, I, well, I wonder what is this is going to be. I saw the picture of the suit, and it's the same suit, but it can't be that because they're not there in that, in well, that time. Well, who do you yet. speculate is going to be – because Mandarin's going to be the villain. Yeah. They already said that. I, I, ben guarantee, gonna... I guarantee the government will build an Iron Man – built it because they they had the war machine yeah. suit uh-huh. so i guarantee they scanned that and built a suit and are like like that's their own and it's gonna be some like some pretty boy yeah i, I like, also heard that wannabe uh, iron man that they had a picture on set and he's gonna get his ass kicked and it was aim oh aim's gonna be it that's a lot of people to well so well they just like there was a one is random not gonna be in it <laughs> oh god no i think the thing i think what they're going to do is they're going to hint at AIM and then going to do it in Winter Soldier. Uh, uh, I, really? Well, but no, they have to do Hydra. 
Yeah, I know, but maybe they're gonna do something weird with. I mean, we don't know yet. I mean, it bring, just. You have to bring. The, this the is just speculation. Up. I don't know. It just says it on the thing, but uh, there yeah, is yeah. aim. They have a set picture of it. That's but. cool, I guess. They were, they're, but they're always the lamest organization. Well, maybe they'll revamp them. I don't know. I They'll guess. do something. They need Bob, agent of Hydra. <laughs> do you know Bob, agent of Hydra? No. That's Deadpool's buddy. Oh God! He, he like, broke, in, he, like <laughs> oh, God. broke into like a, a warehouse thing one time, like like whatever it was, and there's like a Hydra base, and he like takes the guy hostage or a guy follows him or something, and he's Bob, agent of Hydra. <laughs> And he just ends up following him around and becomes like a sidekick, kind of. <laughs> but it's really all more of like like Deadpool almost kills him all the time. <laughs> like, it's hilarious. And uh, they have, yeah, uh, Winter Soldier is going to be starting to shoot in March 2000, uh, 2013. I'm kind of... I'm, 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 I'm ready for it. I, 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 me too. I, I, really I like wish it. it was out like now. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I really like the first one. Me too. Despite I watched what everybody it again. Else. Wait, wait, who says what about that? That was a great movie. They said it was very boring. I disagree with them. I, I thought think it was so pretty cool. Wait, who I says what's boring? Captain America. Captain America. I thought really? that was better than Thor. I thought it was a little. Thor. I, I thought it was that. a little better than Thor. I don't, I don't the, know about that. Because the camera angles just pissed me off. Every other angle is a Dutch or? angle. Yeah, Thor. Yeah, it was. I I, I actually agree. It was weird. Uh, yeah, and, but no, I still like Thor. No, but, I love Thor, but that was, but I, I but I like Captain America Captain. more. Yeah, Captain America seemed like a real movie. Thor seemed kind of like it was like great. they built up this hero. Like he went from nothing. You see yeah. all this development. That was the problem with Thor. Was like right away, you know, yeah. who he is and he's like, but, bam. And I liked it because it was a different spin on things. Like yeah. Tony, like 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 Iron Man, you had to build up to a hero. Yeah, Thor, yeah. Like, he's already a hero. Yeah, put him back. Yeah, but also. It was sort of, it was a sort of, uh, what do you call it? By the books, like you know what I mean? Like, it, what, like what, it had Thor, the beats, Captain America, Thor. Like, it, like it had the beats of what it was supposed to. Yeah, be. it was a fish out of water story. It's like, it was, okay, it and this part's of, gonna go happen, yeah. and now this, and yeah. we're gonna get the big fight, and the ex machina is gonna come in. Yeah, hey, and, and it was like, it was great. I loved it, but it did kind of like you knew every beat that was gonna happen. Yeah. Captain America, it was like, especially when they put him, they put him to work on like PR. You're like, that's hilarious. That's amazing. <laughs> I, I didn't – and Captain America. I didn't really like the, how Bucky died. Uh, that's about right. Uh, I, except in the I mean, I, it's a spaceship. Or like I, a I just wanted to be like General more – like a little more heroic. I mean like it was kind of cool. Like he picked up the gun and was trying to help him and then well, he, he just kind of – Well, he picks up the gun and has the shield. Yeah. And he becomes Captain America eventually. Yeah. Uh-huh. I mean I, it, it was okay, but I just sure. wanted – I just want a little more from that, but yeah. I think this is going to be a great. I thought it was fine because you needed him. You needed Steve to get mad, and you know he's coming back. Well, like, no, yeah, like but you knew he's coming back as Winter Soldier. Yeah, um, there's that. Uh, Josh Whedon. This, this, the TV know. show? No, 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 not the TV show. Fireflies he, coming back? No. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no one's ever going to put that show back on there, Why? even it if so... it was really good. Huh? Why not? I don't it would know. sell well, so well. We're well, going to talk know. about this. No, but Josh, <laughs> I don't think Joss Whedon would even do it. Because it, it, no, it, he it, expressed it, interest well, in it. I, don't think, I, I think he did that for the fan's sake, it, because it lives as this weird little Niche thing, book of, yeah. of, of awesome. Like If you start making another series, it's never going to be as good. I love Serenity. I had, really? I didn't know I mean, I like any it, I didn't know anything about Firefly the movie then I watched the movie really? and I was like wow this is really cool I should get into the TV series and I did and I really liked You're it. You're the only one. Ever. Really? <laughs> I'm the only one who likes Serenity? No, I, I like Serenity, but uh, I can't believe that as a non like you weren't a fan already. I I didn't know. I remember distinctly that it was based on a TV show. Oh. And I went in and I was like wow this is really good. I really like it. And so I went back to the TV show on Netflix, and I thought it was good. really good. That's cool. Um, but no, he announced – what? No, I said, but what's he doing? Oh, oh yeah. He show? announced that he wants to take the second Avengers into more of a darker complex with the characters. Yay. He wants to, like, build up, like, that fighting and the complexity to, uh, again. Oh, really? No, I, don't, I like them being friends. No. It was like, so annoying when they were just like – like bickering for no apparent reason. Well, no, Put they were bickering suit. because they were under his Loki spell. Were they? Yeah, no, they were. They didn't really. No, show that was his that. plan. He never did that. I think he he knew they would bicker because they're humans and they have big egos. Because he never uh, made he never cast. I a think spell. no, I think that was his plan because he needed the Hulk to get angry. But he no, that was totally his plan. But that wasn't a spell. He just knew those guys have big egos and would never get along. Uh, I don't know. Because Captain America and Iron Man are always going to hate each other, even if they love each other at the same time. <laughs> but that's what he says. He says that he's, you know, fully in charge with every Marvel movie now. 
because Marvel has just put him in oh, really? everything. Well, no, because everything? if you're, they're, oh, if wow. they're all leading, because they're all the connected, next yeah. Movies like you have to have the guy that's. Yeah, we're that, not talking about just idea. one individual. That's movie. a good idea. These are all leading up to the next Avengers movie. Yeah, that's this true. Is, he's suddenly like fix in, all like, has way too much power. Yeah. Did you hear what what happened to him thing. in the beginning? Oh, you know what? I guarantee that Buffy the Vampire Slayer movie is never happening now. <laughs> Wait, like, what? They they're gonna make a movie. They were supposed to make another movie without him. And he created the series. Yeah. And like, and they were gonna make a movie without him, without Sarah, like without anyone. It was just supposed to be the name and like. Oh. Uh, so and like the first movie. I guess the name. now he has the power to just be like, that's not happening. <laughs> like, so it has to be like, I guess we're not doing that anymore. Well, well, good. Like, yeah, good. No, I agree. I, if you hear there's there's interviews with all the cast members for that show mm-hmm. of people being like, did you hear about this? And all of them are like, this is Above retarded. It. Yeah. Oh. Above, and, really? And they're like, they're, this is retarded. You can't do. Buffy the vamp- Buffy without Joss. There is no Buffy without Joss. Like, hmm. but um, oh, what was I gonna say? Uh, did you ever hear what happened of him in DC in DC Entertainment? What with uh, Wonder Woman? Yeah, they the guys were like he he put a script towards Wonder Woman, and they were like, no, we don't like this, and he tried kept going back and back, and they just like fired him. And maybe they, it like, was good. Him. Maybe it what maybe it was good. Maybe it was really good, and they're like, we're not gonna take a chance on this. Why would they not take a chance on that? Like he's like because he's a, an established writer. Yeah, I know, but still, but still, they, night, there's a lot of people who are like, I'm not going to take this gamble because it's going to be too much money that we're. Well, they're lose. oh, but they're they're doing a uh, Wonder Woman show now, a not new anymore. one, no new one. Oh, they're like restarting again. Themyscira. There was. It's, it's basically Smallville oh, right. with Wonder Woman. Wow, a- anyway, and it all takes action? place on Themyscira. So oh they God. fired him, got rid of him, and then Marvel got him. Yeah. And now that guy from DC is fired, sucking dick in an alleyway. <laughs> no, but I disagree. I disagree. In I Alex's corner. I yeah, in Alex's yeah, playground. Yeah. He is now a <laughs> He's Alex's friend. Um, no, the but, only one over ten. That's <laughs> Jimmy, the homeless man. Um, <laughs> but I disagree with you. I'm, I bet like $100,000 he put in a script. They probably did like it. They probably it, they're probably afraid to make Wonder Woman. They were probably and they were probably like, we just don't know if we can do this yet. We're, we're gonna, well, yeah, that's a gamble. Gonna, it's like we're I, gonna try I to make this really, movie. We can't. No, you were uh, like you were, you were like they were like they were just like oh we don't like this is bad. You're, you're fired. He wasn't fired. He probably put it in the script. They're like we we'll, we'll keep. Well, no, it. they we'll canceled the contract because he, didn't he have a contract with Warner Brothers or something? Because Warner Brothers DC, so. I think so. You can make scripts without being a contract. No, but he was like. Working specifically for them for a while, but he never done anything. I know exactly, and they're like, okay, maybe he left. But maybe he didn't get fired. But, maybe but there he was left. never even like they, they never they barely even confirmed that he was writing for it. Like, well, he was. They, they said they was like he was like working it came for out Wonder that he had written scripts. Like he had wrote written a script, but it was maybe never they like, just turned they he turned they turned them down. Like maybe we can't do this because how are we going to sell Wonder Woman I'm to a sure general audience? I'm sure he was fine with it because he got paid for it either way. Yeah, but still. <laughs> like, I'm sure he was not I would like, like boo they make my Wonder Woman movie. I would like to see a Wonder Woman movie. I'd, I'd rather him be a Marvel. He knows the Marvel characters better. He's, he's more of a Marvel guy. He, he was an X-Men guy. He was X-Men? He wrote yeah. X-Men for years. Oh. All right. Well, good for him <laughs> the then. The comic book. Like, um, why is he X-Men? on X-Men? <laughs> he wrote Astonishing X-Men for years. They need a new... Oh, did you hear about the X-Men thing? They're Which doing one? the Days of Future Past? Yeah, I know. Oh, uh, you didn't like it? I don't think that works in the movie. I don't think that's gonna well, be. No, well, they're gonna take it. The they're s- gonna take it on a new spin. You know, they're not gonna stay faithful to the book. But it's X Men First Class Two. X Men First Class Two, second class. But, <laughs> I thought it was X Men Second Class. And it's Days of Future Past with different people involved. Like it, it's just very confusing. Well, it's and gonna be gonna, confusing to you, but it won't be confusing to the general audience because no, it'll be new to but them. It's also that's young, how they're selling it. But it's still young Magneto and young Xavier. Can't wait for Michael Fassbender to come. Oh, out. me too. I love him. And, yeah, and, 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 and um, back yeah, I love them as those characters. But not in this storyline. Days of Future Past is really weird. I heard it. It is pretty weird. It's Isn't really, Wolverine in it? Uh, I mean, he was in the books, but they, they they'll were, probably put him in. Uh, uh, come on, what, they would not sales. want to bank on that. Yeah, thank <laughs> you. Just Alex. to say, fuck off again. But, but he's got his own <laughs> movies. The Wolverine. <laughs> he is the most popular. Right? Oh yeah, Wolverine character. too. The yeah. Wolverine. It's just called. Oh, is it, is That's it what it's like, called? It's to, called the Wolverine. Oh, it's not going to be X-Men Origins, Wolverine 2, or no. something like that? No, because everyone wants to forget that. Why would they do that? that. It is. It's the same. It, like, it is so the why would they call world. something different? They would just because call... Because you want to put... Because you don't want to... They want to distance Origins, them. Wolverine 2 sounds stupid. But, but it makes sense. So, they, so there's a lot of stupid titles they Wolverine, come up with. Because they know general people are just like, oh, Wolverine movie's out. 
So you're going to just go see the Yeah, Wolverine it's just going to feel like, oh, is this like the same continuity, continuity or whatever of the first No one wants a continuing of that. Dude, it's movie. fucking Wolverine. Well, it's all people care about. I know, but Look, who, let me, who is that? Let me describe the uh, amazing that's what I'm asking. so this can sink in. Because this is supposed to be X Men First Class. That, I heard it's weird, but uh, okay, here, uh, go let's, for let's, it. Uh, okay, here we go. It deals with a dystopian alternate future alternative future in which mutants are incarcerated in internment camps. An older Kitty Pride who doesn't is running in the movie isn't alive for like forty years in that story in that in that timeline. Transfers her mind into the younger present day Kitty Pride who brings the X Men to a, to prevent a fatal moment in history which triggered anti mutant hysteria. Sounds like a fantastic movie. The, the whole run is amazing. But it just doesn't make sense in their storyline. Like, it's confusing. <laughs> Maybe they'll do it with another character. Or they'll just do something. I don't know. Like you have, like it's so in- embedded in those in those characters. Yeah, I know. But like, if it's were, Hollywood, if, if they came Come out, on. we're just like we're throwing away all the the previous. Uh, I'm not saying like, hey, canon. I would be like, great, do a Days of Future Past movie. That'd be fantastic. I'm behind you 100. percent Let Joss Whedon do his own. But. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> Like, you know, Fox, sell your fucking rights back because you're a loser. And uh, the Sentinels are going to be in it, right? Uh, yeah, huh? they're, yeah, they're supposed to. But Sentinels. Yeah. Huh. Interesting. Big guys. The big, you know, the big, big robot guys. guys. <laughs> big guys. Big pink and purple robots of doom. <laughs> Basically a Galactus, but a robot. And smaller. Yeah, smaller. And He's not a fucking clown. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> And uh, did you see the sets for uh, the set pictures for both Wolverine and uh, the new Thor movie? No, I haven't seen it yet. But... It's pretty cool. They have uh, uh, what's his name, Eccleston. Oh, the... Chris Eccleston. What? Yeah, yeah. Uh, Doing what? The He's Dark Elf, the villain. Elf, the villain. The Thor movie. Oh, that's right. The new Thor movie? Yeah, yeah. it's pretty cool. Oh, it's like, it's cool. like some Dark Elf. An actor I'm gonna know in a superhero movie. Cool. <laughs> He's. Pre- it looks pretty cool. Yeah. It really looks. Pre- I can't wait. I'm. I'm. Way, I'm not gonna lie. Though, I'm way more excited for Captain America. Oh, me too. Like above even Iron Man because I don't Iron Man three I'm unhappy about. Really? Well, what's I don't that? like he's, they're doing the Technus imperative. What's that? Which is uh, is that what it's called? I Brief be... summary. Please. Well, uh, uh, America... he basically, he gets nano. He gets a nano like bot suit. Like where it's not an actual like like his suit is comprised of nanobots. Like so he could basically be like standing around and be like suit and it like like appears on him. Essentially, It'd be a cool effect, but I don't no, know. it's gonna look it's gonna look stupid. It was stupid in the comics. It's cur- I think currently what he wears in the comics, and it, it's just it's not cool. Well, no, I'm excited that Shane Black is writing and directing it. No, I'm sure it'll be good, but and also the Mandarin's hard to do. Well, maybe they found the. Per- I'm I'm really. It's Ben Kingsley, right? Yeah, yeah. I think is, he would make a great. Yeah. yeah, I think he's perfect for the part. It's a really offensive villain. <laughs> Iron Man, I have your power. <laughs> for the uh, the new Captain America movie was it gonna be like him like adapting. Well, well it's happens. about uh, Bucky. So it's, it's gonna happen after the Avengers. Well, it's about, yeah, it's, it after, is about right? it's after the Avengers. It is about him adapting to normal life, but also Bucky coming uh, back you know, to his life. Buddy, the in Captain America, Guys. coming from the 1940s. He he also. Well, no, he frozen. fell into the oh, river course. and froze. Yeah, but but it, it I mean but it's a different thing. It it doesn't have the same impact that it would in the comics because. In the comics, Bucky Barnes is like his teenage sidekick, and he and Steve Rogers fails him. The kid dies in a some horrific explosion, or so, so he thinks. And it, you know, it fucks with Cap's head. Like he failed. He, you know, like like he failed Bucky. That was like the most important thing in his life. And now they're doing like a. And then, and then he comes back as like this badass. He's assassin. a Russian. Like, didn't the Russians like train him yeah, or he, something he like found, that? Like, and then he would be cryogenically frozen and then reawakened. It's like a Manchurian candidate. Need, whatever they need him yeah. for a mission. Yeah. All right, that explains how he, how he came back and just still young. And was, yeah, he's older, but not quite as old. Like, like not as old as I'm he be. so ready to see that. But Me it's too. not the same thing because he's going to be. Like, well, he, it's going to be in a, present day. He, but he was his army buddy. Like, I mean, he was like his friend. Like, I'm sorry, it's different. If your friend dies and a kid that you're basically supposed to be taking care of. Well, no, they're supposed to be really good friends, and he took care of uh, Bucky. Took care of yeah, uh, Cap. Steve, yeah, yeah, Steve. But it's not. But it's different. Like, like he was. It, the idea was that he was in charge. I, I of still him. thought and it if was. If you're in war with your, this guy, you know there's a good chance he's gonna die. Yep. Yeah, but like, like, and so his him coming back won't have as big of a mental impact. I, I took it as like. They were indestructible and no one could beat them because, like, it's Captain America and he's got these new powers and he's gonna, it's the best of his abilities and he could take care of any situation. Yeah. And then his ego, like, kind of took over and it's just like, 
oh, I kind of fucked up, didn't I? Don't I don't think so. I don't I, that's what I took from it. I, I think like they just, were so like they were on a roll. They were on. A they roll. were on a montage. Roll. But I don't think he was, I don't think he was arrogant about it. I just, I oh no, was, I don't. I, okay, a- arrogant, arrogant was like, the wrong word to say. I just thought he just got a little caught up and didn't realize, and it just happened. He forgot everyone else was. Yeah, he forgot everybody else was superpowered nuts. as him. Yeah, I guess. I, I, I'm, I'm excited for those. I, but I don't want to be excited for those movies because that's we got a while. It's, yeah, it's going to be a <laughs> long time. Yeah. Like, we've been on this run of, of amazing superhero yeah. movies, and we got, like, we now have to, like, wait for what? them to reload. It's pretty sad that there's only, like, at least one good superhero movie, like, in a year sometimes. Like, I remember we were on a roll last year where it was X Men First Class. I forgot what the next one Thor? was. Thor, yeah. And Captain, Captain America. America. And Captain America, but so. Green Lantern was the one right in the middle. And like, come on, you got two for, two for four. You got to do it. And You're the only DC representative. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and no. did, did, there was confirmed yeah. sequels to that movie, right? Uh, I don't know. Not there, anymore. There was. There was. <laughs> oh, not, they, they, they haven't it? said no. They haven't canceled it. I, I, thought, I thought it was definite. I wouldn't be surprised if they did. Well, if I, they I, just introduced Justice How did Justice it do in the League. box office? Uh, Cap- it, like, it, it, no, it didn't. It, it made back more than it, was, it cost. It, it, Are you sure? Yes, so it, it did okay. It, it did fine Check it because I don't believe it. Uh, it did, no, I mean, oh, it didn't have a great open weekend, but it, it did fine financially in the end, and that's all that matters. As long as it makes what it cost, at least, it, it, I think it just fine. got back to you some think, of like, his mind. Because think about it. Worldwide, that movie... Definitely, I'll, I'll pull it up on like box office mojo. Do you think, you think Green Lantern is like a hard movie to make, or do they think just like a like a, uh, a, a lazy job? I, I, you know what? Thing, no, 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 this is what I think. Here, can I can I spoil? No, can I speak? no, fuck you. I wasn't actually. I didn't have anything else to say, so <laughs> I'm laughing at Jose. <laughs> but uh, no, um, no, I think the producers had no idea how to like show this, it like is, to show and thing. represent this character, and. I, and first of all, you had all the worst people because they were all TV producers, and the whole production yeah, looked true. like a TV show. It's like it uh, this might have looked like that. a pilot. I don't know about that. Rewatch. I rewatch on HBO. I've seen it, and it a looks, lot of times. Ugh. It looks like TV, qual- like bad CW TV quality at points. I'm, the, I'm, talking about the especially CGI. with Blake Just Lively. Just because Blake Lively's in the movie. <laughs> and uh, screaming nut faces in it. It did make money. It made, uh, budget was two hundred million. It made two twenty million. Yeah, it, that, that's it all. It just they care made about. back its but money. But that, that's all they care about, studios. Yeah. Well, it's the word of mouth too. That's probably like overseas too. It's a com- combination. Yeah, but that's, yeah. But that's, that's all that matters. They, they made twenty million dollars on that movie. Is that enough for uh, spawning like a series yeah. sequel? Uh, yeah, maybe they, they would. Yeah, they would have. But the fact that they're they launching a Justice League like movie, the, the fact they're launching a Justice League movie, I can hear it. Okay, is uh. I would say they might. Oh yeah, they still forfeit the the sequel to that and just introduce him in. I'm the looking Justice forward movie. to Superman. What do you mean, like, Me like, like totally reboot him or use that same, uh, I same would use Ryan uh, Green Lantern? I think Ryan Reynolds was good. I, think I thought he was good, good too. I say yeah. so. Like, it's just he it's, was carrying just gonna that confuse movie people. You're just gonna confuse people if you just like like reboot the movie again, like not, like two years after it came oh, out. Oh yeah, yeah, two. And then well, yeah, make the Justice League. There is no Half Life for movies anymore. Like, I, I don't like what they're doing with like and Spider-Man. Sp- yeah, Spider-Man. That was the right years. thing. Yeah. All right, but like Batman, that's kind of ridiculous. Like rebooting the movie, then the Justice League. Well, movie. no, that's all for money. You know. Yeah, I know, but like it's confusing. But the thing is, you like the the whole. It's too soon. Well, in the case we of need Batman, to mourn. No, we Alex, need more Batman. Alex, no, I would I agree with you for the most case, but in, the, in terms of Batman, they kind of have to. Why? Because, because that's, that's their only money maker. Because yeah. Christian Bale's not going to do it. Because Harry Potter ended. Oh, he, he's he's yeah. not going to. Warner do Brothers it. has nothing. Dude, Warner Christian Brothers Bale would have not done nothing. the Dark Knight really? movies if there was a Robin. He he said he said that he said he wouldn't do. Yeah, 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 that's, yeah, yeah. No, that's quoted. All right. That's true. Wait, so, what about Robin? If there was if a Robin, there was a, if that was Robin an excuse. was an actual character in the in the Chris Nolan movies, Christian Bale would have not have done it. We're, but that didn't. Why, why are you even talking about that? There because was a Robin. Though. No, because he's questioning why they're rebooting Batman, and the, one of the reasons is because Christian Bale won't work. No, for Justice League. it's not at all. Because Chris Nolan was like, "I'm done." Yeah, Chris Nolan was like, yeah, and then I'm Christian Bale was like, "All right, if Chris is leaving, I'll leave too." No, nah, and my, then Gary that's Oldman exactly what and then Morgan even, Freeman. And why? No, no, I know Robin have anything about. to do with it. <laughs> Well, no, before they even said that this was going to be Nolan's last one. Yeah, but Chris Cr- Nolan uh, said he was never going to put Robin in it. But wait, wait, wait. <laughs> I, I, haven't but seen, I, I haven't seen Returns, but my friend said that... Batman Rises. Rises. 
I was going to say, you haven't seen Batman Returns? I had a glass and a half. <laughs> okay, I had a cup and a half. All right, I don't remember. So. Stop it, bitching. You don't need to. I mean, All right. Penguins with but my, I, I haven't seen it, but my friend said that they introduced a new character was a cop, and he, he said, oh, that's Robin. John like, Blake. Uh, kind his of his name is not Dick Clark. Dick Grayson. Dick Grayson. Whatever. Dick Grayson. Yes. <laughs> Dick, Clark. Dick, Clark. Dick Clark. Dick Clark is dead. Dick Clark. Dick Clark. It's too soon. <laughs> <laughs> Dick Clark as the oldest Robin on Earth. America's oldest Robin. <laughs> and he has a stroke. Let's go, Batman. Batman. I'm the... Broke Alex. <laughs> yep. All right, that's Holy well, I got Batman. Batman. <laughs> Happy New Year. <laughs> he died during the middle of the production. <laughs> and they were just all sort of sitting around a table like they had the CGI. Why would I even why would I even why would we even put Dick Clark in his <laughs> Whose decision was this? <laughs> Don Rickles was standing there. Dick Clark is America's favorite team. Oh, his team. And Chris, if Christian Bale died, Don Rickles would replace Christian Bale. <laughs> the dynamic duo. America's Bowling ball player. and McStrokey. <laughs> I'm crying. Um, anyway. Um, oh, I guess to a layman... You'd be like, yeah, oh, like, I, I guess that crazy. cop was Robin. But was it implied that this no, no, guy was going to be Robin? No, his actual name was Robin. Yeah, his name was Robin Blake. The first thing, oh, yeah, they're just Robin. Like, no, his name's not Dick Grayson. They can't do that. Is they... Well, no, yeah. Well, well one, no, this one, is one, there Nolan's has been first. Robins, yeah, but the first one fair. is Dick Grayson. And I think it was supposed to be close to Tim Drake, that John Blake, Tim Drake. Yeah, I guess but so. They made him basically, is a co- I'll just spoil it for you. I don't care. Go There's ahead. a cop who was uh, in the whole movie was kind of the only competent person. He was person. an orphan. He was an orphan and could tell that Bruce Wayne was Batman because he's an orphan and Batman's an orphan. And apparently, only orphans know this have, power. Have, <laughs> like, orphans have telepathic some, ability. Yeah, it's orphans it's have like some kind of telepathy between the, each other. <laughs> <laughs> and he, like when he was a kid, you like Nintendo too. <laughs> when he was a kid and, and saw. Bruce Wayne come to their orphanage. He was like, "He's Batman. He's he's a motherfucking Batman." Yeah, for some reason, it was some really lame. Whatever. But he did figured they out he's ever Batman. Ever imply in the movie though? This is Robin. Yes, they, yes. They at the end, Batman they said it. leaves. Batman leaves. No, they don't the imply that. Batman dies at the end of the movie. It's then revealed later he's alive in Italy or something. Yeah, no, but right. but he left the city. He basically leaves uh, like his house as some like like. Home, like like some orphan home for boys forever, yeah. and base Ed gives John Blake uh, I think a package or something. Yeah, he gives him like, a, he comes, a duffel uh, bag. He comes to the will. He he comes to like uh, to the county office or whatever. And for I, like uh, for, I, well, I don't know why he would imply he was in Bruce Wayne's will. Well, I guess he put it in like towards the end. He's like, I know. It's no, but I'm saying, why would John Blake imply he was in Bruce Wayne's will? I don't know. But whatever, he goes to well, like they met the place, and like, he was like, yeah. does he have any for me? He's like, what's your name, John Blake? And they're like, no. And he's like, oh, it might be under, under my, my real name. name. And then, oh, no, no. And, and what's his real gives, name? And then he like, gives it to him. And she's like, oh, you should use your real name. Uh, Robin. Robin. I, li- I like that. And it was like, oh. And what All he right. gave him was, like, I guess directions. No, it was a whole – it was a duffel bag full of, like, gadgets and stuff. Well, and directions why to – Why would he even need gadgets? He, he, he gave him directions to the cave. Well, and they gave him other stuff. Like he it's goes, a big duffel bag. He goes into the bat cave at the end, and it's implied he takes over – the mantle, because yeah. every you know they need a Batman or someone like it. Well, it's basically Batman. But His he's name not. is Robin, but it would but, basically. But he could be no. Batman because the whole. No, no, no. That, that's what I'm is, saying. Right. His name is Robin, but he'll just be the new Batman. No, but uh, that's what I'm saying. I don't think he he will become the but new the, Batman. But the whole the thing idea is, is Batman sacrificed himself and became like an icon. They have a statue to him and stuff. Like if Batman just came out again, it's like I'm back. <laughs> like. <laughs> he, he actually does that. <laughs> he waves his arms in the air. Well, no, no, and I'd like to point out another issue because you love that movie. I don't. He left Batman and the city to a guy that had no training except the Gotham PD training. <laughs> well, Batman trained with the greatest ninjas and assassins in the world, Bruce Wayne, and this kid has like never done anything. He has, like, minor cop training, and he's like, no. here you go. Here. Here's all my vehicles and gadgets and flying planes Here, and tanks. I'll and- explain to you 
Batman's fine. He probably, you ready? You ready? I don't want to be Batman anymore, so here you go. Fuck you. I'm going, <laughs> I'm Italy, going to Italy. With my new cat girlfriend. I'm going to go say hi to Alfred. <laughs> fuck her pussy, man. Is her name at least Selena Kyle? Yeah. Is that her? Okay, at least, at least I got that part right. Oh, uh, no, no, she was one of the only... Like okay, but like, how could they miss that? Pe- why did they call him uh, Dick Grayson then? Why they have to? Because he didn't. It's he's, not Robin. He's not Robin. He's, but like, it's why just did they his like name. to the fact? Oh, my name's Robin. Why because would that's you do that? It was like a wink, wink, guys. Nudge, nudge. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but why would you do that? They just don't put that in the movie. I agree. Don't put. <laughs> like, I thought you guys as comic fans, you, 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 especially. You'd I be, agree. You'd be like pissed off about that. I streaming. was for months. Okay, <laughs> I wasn't. But I didn't hear any of it. I was in bed beside myself. He had an IV. <laughs> it was maybe, terrible. Maybe you don't want to spoil it for he me, was but speak, I hear he, it. Yeah. He was speaking to Jose. And he's <laughs> he's <laughs> like, how can they do this? <laughs> the comic must come back. It's not <laughs> Dick Clark. It Why was, is it Dick Clark? Uh, drop it! <laughs> Why is it he drop it? <laughs> and Jose is just like, Dick Clark's an old stroke victim. <laughs> <laughs> he must come back. Oh, that would be hilarious. I want to... Wait, isn't he dead? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah he's fucking dead. Remember, remember, okay, he died. So okay. is Jason Todd. It's okay. <laughs> it's all right. Like, but so, rewind a year ago. Yeah, if if, if they no, filmed this right. movie and they put Dick Clark in it, I'm like, that's Robin. Like, <laughs> anyway. Happy New Year. That's, that's Nightwing. No. Dick Grayson, <laughs> no. Dick Grayson has been Nightwing, and so has Clark Kent. <laughs> what did you say that? Why did you say that? Wait, what? what? Wait, Clark Kent, Clark Kent was Nightwing? Yeah. Oh my God, comic book novices. Nightwing refers to oh oh hipster man. Nightwing hipster. <laughs> Nightwing refers to the Kryptonian heroes, Nightwing and Flamebird. I don't give a shit. That moving were, on. T- when, talking about Superman. And when Clark Kent and Jimmy Olsen got shrunk down to the Bottle City of Candor, they became basically Batman and Robin down there because Clark doesn't have powers in there. They became Nightwing and Flamebird. He was he was Nightwing. Jimmy was Flamebird. Oh, and then okay. yeah, when Ooh. Robin had quit and was looking for a new identity, he was like, "Why don't you go by Nightwing?" You know, you know that's a Kryptonian hero, and it kind of sounds like you know your brooding mentor, like kind of thing. So it's the best of both his worlds. I wish the people listening could see my face. <laughs> <laughs> mean our right fan, now. <laughs> tennis one 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 five. Yes, tennis, tennis, tennis. Yes, tennis. I love you. <laughs> we all love we you. We love tennis. We want to go to your house and fist you in the <laughs> 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 Oh so wait, wait, is, after he hears so us, wait a minute. We're we not, lost our fan, guys. We lost our fan. So wait, we're not that. fisting. We're fisting him, not his bear. <laughs> <laughs> Both. I'll fist him. And when he's out, I'll fist his bear. All right, we'll all take turns. I'm out. Right, I'll fist anything that moves. <laughs> or doesn't move. Steady bears are inanimate objects. Oh. All right, Jose, you I'll get go, his dog. I'll, I'll, I'll hold him down. <laughs> all right, Dave, you took it to a really dark place. Uh, <laughs> animal abuse is never funny. Oh, okay. No. Yep. How dare you, <laughs> asshole. And you know what? Here's my sheet shady transition to my top ten list. <gasps> Problems with fucking Americans. Top ten list. You even mentioned you were making it this time. This is just coming out. Let Jose's me know. top ten. Ten things Jose wrote down. I well, love how <laughs> Jose's top ten. <laughs> so Americans, no, I'm the only jingle. About. I am the only jingle. So, so top ten for Jose, it, for a top ten... Why you hate Americans? It's just why you hate white people. That's so that. why don't you just yeah, rename it? Americans <laughs> are basically white people, dumb. Yeah, oh, white people. Fuck balls. Nine out of ten of these are white. White people. <laughs> All right. So. All right. Go we'll ahead. Rephrase it. Ten things Jose <laughs> wait, hates wait. about white people. Where, where did this? This is so. Where did this all come from? This is so random. <laughs> wait, what? He was where working this on come it. From? Why do you think Jose hasn't said a word in like an hour? And he a was thinking. Like, no idea. He was thinking and taking down my fuck yous. <laughs> yeah. It's because we're all white. They hate like, like why I fucking hate these guys right here sitting next to me. This is why I hate them. They this save their people. money. What's wrong with my co-host? <laughs> anyway, they say fisting a lot. They don't mow their lawns. This is why I hate these people. I don't mow my lawn either, motherfucker. <laughs> that's that, right. Well, I have you mixed... are the worst stereotype that ever existed. He only owns a leaf blower. Give him a chance to <laughs> upgrade. <laughs> I'm working. I'm working with barbers. Anyway, I'm gonna go down this list. This is the things that. Bother me about America. Right, starting from the white okay, people. people. <laughs> <laughs> well, we have the Kardashian type celebrities. So let's face it; they don't deserve. The there are non-white celebrities that people obsess about. So okay, like the, the white thing was just a joke. <laughs> I, and the Kardashians are Libyan or whatever. Not Libyan. I know. That's I know. Not the right again, again, <laughs> again. <laughs> the <laughs> Libyans. <laughs> 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 They look like white bands. We should probably talk about that. But again, we'll yeah, this is my problem that? with yeah. Americas. America. Because in any other America. country, 
Those okay. bitches would just be normal bitches. That's not true. And uh, they do the same thing in England. I agree. How we, 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 we idol- France. Not idolize France. these like celebrities, and they're just like dumb bitches. I agree. They're a that. bunch of fucking whores. Yeah, well, look, look, they, they have no like leadership qualities whatsoever. But yet we uh, anyway we leadership to qualities. Nothing. No. What is that? Like? <laughs> they, they, they do you really, really want like... Kim Kardashian to be the leader? No, of not like, literally. Like, like, so I trust the bag of Doritos I replaced you with. Not literally. For the Kardashians. <laughs> but wait, since when do any celebrities have leadership not li- qualities? But, like, in a societal way, not literally. Just like you know, like a role. All right, role models. Role models. models. Where is that wrong? Role models. They models. are not role models at all. Yeah, but but people treat them as role models for whatever. Reason. Why? What do you see? I just see don't in understand them? people. Right? Tits. I don't like. Well, no. Well, no, no. no we no, no, see no. tits. No. <laughs> All right. It's the been... best news of this whole month. The Jersey Shore being canceled. That was the best news. But it's of this the month. no. The, I'll tell you exactly what people see in them. They do nothing and they get paid millions of dollars for it. They want. That's like, a pretty like, goddamn. I, I want to get paid a million dollars. I know. For doing they're a role dick. model to me. Like. <laughs> Look, that's do nothing and get paid? I like that idea a lot. I'm yeah, very lazy. No. Well, now I can say why I hate white people. Because <laughs> that's number one. Lazy bastards. No. Everyone's lazy. Why don't you skip all every the way single, to one? Every <laughs> single race in the entire world, Rappers. if you were like, would you like a billion dollars to do nothing, or would you like to work hard for your entire life? Every single person on the face of the earth would be like, I'll take the billion dollars. Okay. I would, I would kill myself after two years. Rappers. Like, what am I going to do with this money? They, I'm fucking people, bored. No, people get not. paid. You are so full of shit. You would, it's not even funny. You could buy 10 no, planes. No, no. You could fly everywhere in the entire world. No, you're saying, that's a pilot. What it, no, that's what it means. That's a you get $2 billion dollars and you just spend and do nothing. You, you, do, you no, just take it like, oh, I got a car and I'll drive around. I can't hey, live guys. that way. You, you, what are you talking about? You can travel everywhere in the world. You can just you go on a cruise. spend your life. You, you can you, work. For fun, you can just go places and build houses. You can fuck for... any woman you want, even a guy. Alex, you can fuck all the build a bears. I don't want to fuck Alex. You can buy build a bear. You can buy Alex and you get know in what the. You I'm gonna do with my money. You can buy build a bear and just change it to fist a bear. <laughs> fist a bear warehouse and make it PG for everyone. <laughs> Every bear has a hole in its ass. <laughs> Automatically. <laughs> All right then. All right. So anyway, nine. <laughs> Low IQ TV because I don't. I watch some TV nowadays, and I'm like, I don't bother anymore. I'm so isn't turn that the TV. same thing I, as Kardashian? But I, I, no, because I argue, Wiener Circle. I argue that TV doesn't need to be high IQ. I think. I think there's something to be said there's always, for zoning out and watching something. That's and besides, useless. there's always there's like channels for everybody. Well, that, that's there's different always because, something for because everyone. you don't take that stuff seriously when you're zoning out. But some people, that's what I'm saying. Some people that actually watch TV to watch these series. Like, Nobody's watching seriously. Reader Circle for the drama. I know exactly people are what watching Jersey Shore for the drama. People are watching the talking no, with the Kardashians for like the drama. No, a lot of people just to see them being fucking stupid. Yeah, or like, and most people that are them don't realize they they think they're watching it. So like oh yeah, <laughs> I don't know. I don't well, understand. I don't understand the mentality of the people like. Dave, you Shore. know there's nothing in there, right? No, it, there is. We have oh, a look. jug of water, dude. There's we have water a coming jug out. Of water. Here's well, some more in here, and I want to do my <laughs> gasoline thing. <laughs> Here's a more serious problem in America. And that's the fact that all the healthy alternatives are expensive as fuck. Yeah. Uh, by the way, Fast your, your mic just kind of fritzed. It fritzed? Yeah, it was not on for a second. And then yeah, so I don't know what's like going on. Hopefully the, hopefully the other one's picked up. <laughs> he anyway. just fritzed. Hey, he just fritzed. killed 20 Jews. <laughs> oh. Anyway. oh, dude. So, healthy oxygen oh, okay. are expensive oh, yeah, as fuck. that's right. No juice. Yeah, yeah, you know what? That's, what that's why asses. America is so fat. Because McDonald's... Well, a meal at McDonald's... You know what? So no. fat, Alex. No, no, solve our problem. All right. A meal no, no, McDonald's, I agree. A meal at McDonald's is $7. A meal at, like, I don't know. Some, An actual, like, a healthy restaurant. salad? Yeah. It's like twelve. Yes. and I'm like, I'll take McDonald's the, the Big seven dollars. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> right. You, you know how much lettuce is at the store? Go buy some fucking lettuce. Make your own salad. It's really cheap. But Americans are too lazy. Yeah, but to yeah, that, there you go. But that is the they have to go to the store. They have to walk all the way to the produce section. They have section. to walk are from you? the parking no, no, lot no, no, no. to I'm the saying, store. No, no, I'm saying just general American mentality. I will agree with Jose. They have to drive to the shop and stop or me for wherever. Shop and stop. Shop and stop. That's the common thing I get at my job. <laughs> anyway. Can I have to stop and shop roast beef? Shop and stop roast beef? Okay. And so they drive in. As they got to the walk in there. Stop. They got to walk all the way to the uh, produce and get their shit and buy it. And, and they, they have, have to, to prepare it. it themselves. They have to make it themselves. That's too much to ask. But that's, you know what? But <laughs> that's that's too like, much time. But I'm saying great. Because Americans are such in a rush to do everything. But, that's, but then, but, but Jose's point versus, is versus versus you sitting in a car. 
are not hard, are not more expensive. It's healthy, quick choices are yeah. expensive. But if yeah. someone had the option, if you went out, if yeah, you but that's, your way, that's you the buy the individual ingredients, it's make healthy stuff. It's quick. Americans like for quick. people who just are impatient. Admittedly, Kyle does Which have a point there, but that's generally American. what I was referring to. Just the quick option. Yeah. But that, but yeah, but food's not supposed to be quick. Food isn't supposed to be the, not like, America. It's not, no, not, it's not in America. To, yeah, but that's, working in my Chinese place. It, this is why general I, tells need to be done work now. Chinese takeout places. <laughs> but my, but, but I'm, I'm, this is why I'm editing Jose's thing. I I disagree. Uh, he, he's right in a different way. Americans' problem is that food has become both a central point in their life and something to shove down your throat and get get rid of. Like go go through the day. Food's supposed yeah. to be. You're supposed to sit food down. is really cheap here compared have, to like country, other countries. Food is expensive. That's why everyone's like really, you know, like not overweight food. like we are. Kyle, <laughs> I can get twelve chicken burritos for ten dollars a taco. Look bell. at that. Yeah. That's not right. <laughs> you get a head of lettuce for <laughs> buy like two bucks. Fuck you. I can go to Honduras. Uh, this mic is fucked up. Today. Other countries. I'm not saying all you countries. Share with me, there are a lot of other countries. <laughs> That don't have like fast food chains that are yeah, more expensive than we are. Yeah, fast food is not food, dude. Again, fast food for food, America, yes, no, it but, is. Yeah, but that's the that's the problem. It's yeah. not that healthy food is expensive. It's that fast Prepared. food. It's about how quick we need. Okay, shit for, on the for a college board. student, I'm hungry and I need it now. For a college student who doesn't cook, the options are slim if so you're on a cook. budget. Like, or just eat salad. You're like a I poor right college. You have the time. I'm not talking about me. I'm talking about the uh, the typical People poor college dorm. student. And people who Bill really Dorn. don't have that. You can go buy a head of lettuce and some tomatoes and make a salad. Again, it's they don't want to prepare it. No, they want don't. is the key word there. Yeah, you could buy it, but then you're going to get somebody else to. Hey, uh, Jim, roommate, uh, no, I'm I saying... got all these special ingredients, no, that's all and I'm I know how you know I'm saying, to cook. I'm saying America's problem is that they're like, eh. I don't want to do that. I'll go buy McDonald's. Th- that's what I'm talking yeah, about. That's, that's, that's what we're that's saying. The problem yeah. isn't the healthy options are more expensive. It's that the healthy options are No, no, that's what we're saying. Prepared options well, are more expensive. Saying. Well, that's what we're saying now. You guys were saying. We're differing so much <laughs> that we're getting confused. All right. We came full circle in our agreement. All right. Do you agree that, like, the, the ingredients to make, like, a McDonald's cheeseburger are a lot more cheaper than ingredients to make, like, a, a, like a nice salad? It is. Uh, it is. Know. They use a lot of cheap chemicals. Well, I mean, if you could buy, the why you they use their chemicals. Make a McDonald's cheeseburger. I don't know. It's just like any type of like cheap cheeseburger. It, it's less expensive to make that than like to, like any other like prepared food. Well, yeah. I mean, even though for making it or not. Yeah, but but you're not buying. You're not making that. You're going because you're like, ooh, they'll just give it to me now. But still, it, it is cheaper to make something more unhealthy and, and like. You only need processed material than it is for something that's pure. It is cheaper to buy something that's processed yes, but not than it is I pure. Like drunk outs, but I also hate drunk outs. I talk too much. But it's not significant. But the, the I'm difference making is a point. Drink. I'm but the problem is that you're not buying the ingredients. They, you know, what they pay for a what McDonald's pays for each hamburger to make that? So cheap. Ten cents. Yes. Roughly. But you're not it's paying so that. You're I know, I know you're paying that, which is still cheap, even though if you're paying more than but it takes paying, to make if, it. If you buy a number th- like three and it's like it, and large with a with a fry, like or or small with a fry, it it still ends up being like seven eight bucks. You can seven eight bucks. You can go to the food store and get way better food. But yeah, but th- that's the thing of convenience. You can get a nice someone who prepared it. You're also paying for the labor. Of the guy who makes the back of McDonald's yeah, making why, the cheese. You're paying for Jose. You're, <laughs> all right, that's going too far. But I'm just saying, you're, you're paying true. for the labor <laughs> and the ingredients. That's what you're paying, you. and it's still cheaper than that. buying it at the store. Mm. Say you could. No, I don't. I don't. I'll I pay ten bucks. I don't know. It, it labor, the labor thing is the issue. That's the issue. It's, the not, it's not the food. Like we, we went from one issue food. of the food but to admit another. But like, to another. Besides yeah, me and you. All right, fuck you, assholes. Next on the list. Yeah, let's go. Oh, 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 dude, you're, you're, thing. You're, you're, thing. Your fucking list is giving us topics. Yeah. And you're I like know, but when we're an hour and a half in, I think we can take right. it easy. I yeah, make one more statement. I forgot the statement was. <laughs> All right, well, fuck you. Let's move on. Bears have tight ass. <laughs> <laughs> it's really hard to fist the grizzly bear. All right. <laughs> Next on the list, greedy bankers. And that's all I'm saying because you guys are going to spend like that's six a, hours on that. That's, 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 that's not even. Like, I don't that's know why that was really that even. That's, that's yeah. so. <laughs> well, then my so. next problem is uh, Starbucks. There's too fucking many. I know that's an old problem, no, but not. it bugs not the shit out of me. as many as McDonald's. No. There's Back like one in Deer Park. What's up? There's like one in Deer Park. I don't know. I see there's some. Not too many. I see a lot in between campuses when I travel all the time. The corner, like McDonald's. Oh yeah, yeah. No, but that's that's for like supply and demand. Huh? Yeah, Purposes. people go to Starbucks. Well, Same thing with McDonald's. Yeah, like, like, like how is Starbucks hurting you? Uh, unlike McDonald's, I just don't the like idea Starbucks. of Starbucks is hurting him. <laughs> yeah, but not still. Starbucks itself. 
the idea. Starbucks <laughs> gave me cancer. Fuck you. <laughs> Unlike McDonald's, Starbucks is the more expensive option of coffee, but McDonald's is the less expensive option of food. You know, we're not doing the salads. We're, <laughs> <not doing this. laughs> we're done with that. You, you get like a one dollar coffee and you get like deli or something. Yeah, but like, uh, Starbucks is like five Starbucks bucks. Starbucks is the American ingenuity. I don't came know to life. Mean. Fuck Starbucks. No, All right, whatever. Whatever. That was a, that was a stupid point. Just make another point. Well, the next one is, is, is just defines a whole group of stupid people, which are these super religious idiots that refuse to believe anything because a magical book that isn't even meant to be taken literally is written written. Well, well they're extreme fanatics. All right. I'm going I can make it to play devil's advocate again. I can make again. an hour discussion about this. Huh? I'm going to play a devil's advocate again. You don't know if that book was meant to be taken literally or not. It you wasn't! Were, you don't know that. You were not there. We have no idea you what it's no supposed idea. to mean. That could all be true. It probably isn't, but it well, could all be true. Not. It was written by some, some random monks. Really it wasn't it like could come be. on, a guy who got it a Pinocchio written. story with yeah, the guy with the whale. It, it, wasn't, like it, not the <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't like it was written for, <laughs> by St. Peter himself. It was just written by like Kyle, 500 years I don't think later. He even, I don't think he was even Kyle, involved. I'm, no, <laughs> I think he was it wasn't involved by in like something Kyle. like St. Peter. I'm pretty sure it is documented the Old Testament was not meant to be taken literally. They were just stories in the world. No, no, no. It is never said that because the idea is crazy. Time out. It was, it was the book was there, especially the Old Testament was seen as true stories and to keep so, stupid people in line, or, or average people. Everyone. Or will God will fuck fair. them up? <laughs> yeah, the idea was you have to be good people, or else God will rain down fire, or turn someone into. So salt, it's basically or, a religion based right, on fear. It's yeah, a that's based of course on that's fear. what religion is based on. It's based on and then fear. the New Testament is where God went into anger management and has a song. All right, George. <laughs> all right, George Carlin one and two. That's not what. Like, but it's a, but no. But like it, the, the, the thing intention is, of the no. Old Testament was meant to teach small like stories. This history it was through, not man. meant to be taken literally. Uh, I disagree. No, it wasn't. But that's just it. It's been. You pro- don't know that. You don't know that. I'm at all. pretty damn sure. There's never been a. There's. There's. It was problems. four thousand years ago, Jose. There's no record of being like, don't take this literally. It, and there's and nothing in fine of, print that says that. My point of playing devil's advocate, you know I'm the biggest agnostic you know, is that you can't say anything about religion one way or another. Because it's all shit we don't know about because it was 4,000 fucking years ago. So if you say it's true or if you say it's 100% not true, you can't say that. Because but what you if don't it's, know. What if it's scientifically disproven, though? You can't know that. Science is, is just as right. much theory as religion. As religion. But that wasn't but part of religion any, more any, so. If you, yeah, re, yeah religion's a little bit fucked up. But, <laughs> but science, we don't know up. for a fact gravity exists. That's a, that We don't know that for a fact. We, we don't know we, anything. We took that as like, okay, if I pick something up and drop it, it drops. So that must be a thing. Not and right we went to space and we, we dropped it. It didn't drop. All right, there's no of that thing out there. We There's no know, that thing. Well, we don't know what that thing is. We made up an idea. Math doesn't exist. We made up math. It, it's something humans created. Everything you've ever learned is Time is, all is a concept Words. created by humans. But you know what? Much. It's practical. It it's usable. It's, it's, it betters our society. It, it, so did religion back then. Not anymore. No. Uh, well, I disagree. People, I think I think faith is extremely helpful for people. It gets okay, okay. people through the day. When, when, I say reli- for, when, when I say religious idiots, these are the people right. that, that take organize, right. organized you religion. Said, you just said religion doesn't help us today. It does. I, it, it does. It depends. I retract it depends. that statement because right. yeah, that was something a, that was like I retract, right. I retract that statement because Wait, I, something Alex like, wants to yeah, talk. something like Buddhism or Hinduism, which bo- Buddhism is not a religion. May I add? It's, it's a it philosophy. Is. No, it's, it's not. All right, it's not a religion. It's considered a religion. No, it's even a though no, it's not. It is a philosophy, but people consider it as a religion because they don't know what it is. Then uh, all right. Yeah. Well, it's a. It's sort of a brand. You can be Hindu. But you can be something else. There is no belief in God. It's just moral. Because you can be Catholic and Buddhist. Okay. That's the thing. You can be both of those. Because Buddha was a dude who taught things. He right. wasn't. He never claimed to be God. Yeah, it was just some guy like you know, like we, should, we should have. Dude. We shouldn't do bad things. We should have morals. We should live our lives good. I, I agree with that. But Hinduism, like, I, I'm dude, all for is that. Like more fucked up than any of them. I'm all for Hinduism that. Hinduism has like, 300 million gods. Well, yeah, the Hinduism. But Hinduism is a th- <laughs> like spiritual religions. I can agree with, but like something like I don't know, like six thousand Ju- Judaism, well, no, Muslim. Just, no, Islam. you just see Islam. all like these fanatics Judaism. out there, and it's like that's a very small minority yeah, that's yeah. just very vocal, it's just very and it's specific. just like turning off everybody else. Like, oh, I don't want to be that. I don't want to be like that. Well, well, you don't have to be like that. <laughs> yeah. Fuck the like Westboro much. Baptist Church. Thing. Well, yeah, stuff yeah, like that. Yeah. Like, yeah. Red shit, state. <laughs> shit is my like mic not working today or something? Yeah, it's been going on wrong. Like, like, I think it's broken. Like, is this, like, voice coming in? Yeah, yeah, it's coming in now. But, 
But no, I that's the I'm one I am Hello. I am so agnostic it's not even funny. I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna, gonna have to agree with yes. Kyle. <laughs> I'm so agnostic it's not even funny. Like we don't but know I anything as people. You, it's so the Yeah, we're idea, still a primitive race. Like like listen to this. I learned this in like oceanography class. We we'll, like thirty years ago we learned that the plates the reason why our continents drift is because the plates co- uh, like die. It, it was 1965. I learned that it was 1965. That was almost 50 All right, years fine, ago. but still, it was not too <laughs> no, long. Ago. A, come on. How we learned people how didn't know world and for works. like a thousand years the world was round. They yeah, that was, flat. That, no, uh, that was my point. What are you doing yelling at me about my point? Oh ago. no, I, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> you see, he's cringing in the corner. I don't yell at me of no things. No. A thousand years ago, we thought our world was flat. It just proves it's from MIB, right? It Isn't proves that the how lines? much little we know. <laughs> yeah, a thousand years ago, we knew the world was flat. Yeah, and, uh, yeah. Uh, and yeah. some guy, well, I don't know, Galileo comes around. Galileo. Let's say this guy in Galileo comes around and says, like, "Oh, maybe the world isn't so flat." And like, people are like, you said, maybe, you we, crazy? Re- maybe we, we know. revolve around the sun maybe, and not the sun revolving yes. around us. We know that we're the center of the universe. We know that the world is flat. What are you talking about? You're crazy. It's the same thing that happens today, basically. It's just, you know, like but some yes, guy who yes. comes out says something the opposite, like, but, but, gets but my point, upon. my point was, how do you know that, like, because we don't know what we think we know, you don't know. Maybe Jesus is going to come back to We don't know. It'd what? be weird. Yes. I would be, I, I would be like, whoops, I was wrong. Well, the whole 2012 but, thing has been disproven because, like, they didn't account leap, year, like, leap years into their well, calendar. Oh, 2012, that's bullshit. I, well, I, think, I, I think the Mayans were like, we're not going to be long. Come on, even if, <laughs> if we're going to get literal in the Bible, it says, if it's like, compare, even God doesn't know what time, what day, what year that it's going to happen. So like, just, well, well, just give it up. up. I, <laughs> just you, stop doing go, that. The end of the world in the Bible is the book of Revelations. Funniest thing most fucked up book of all time. I love it. Do you actually read the Bible? Yeah. yeah. I, I read the whole thing. I want to do that. I want to read the Bible. <laughs> I, I loved it. It's great. There's torture. No, no, there's the Old Testament's amazing. New Testament so gets cool. a little boring. Yeah, I know, right? Book of Revelation. Such a good it plot. It's so fucked up that you're just like, I don't know what's going on. There's Jesus, dragons. There's lands Jesus and seals. just showed up on a horse with a sword on fire. Like, yeah, right. it was crazy. So crazy. But Epic. If you hear, if you hear religious <laughs> scholars story, talking man. about uh, uh, the book of Revelations, they're like, I don't really know why this got in. Um, it was there. There was a bunch of other end of the world stories that we could have picked from, but someone was like this crazy nonsense. <laughs> this but one was the coolest yeah, out of all. Someone of them, was right? like, I was like, was like this whole book. You know, Jesus is just like love, yeah. peace. Yeah, happiness. and that's another thing. Like they just leave out certain stories. Like oh, this one's not important. Mm. Throw it out. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I mean you have to do it though. The thing like, that we we'll, have to you, edit it you down. Really want the Bible to be ten thousand pages. I like the history. That'd be nice. I love I love history, yeah. and I love to go through something. Yeah, like me that. too. History is awesome. I'm sure if you got you know if you went to the Vatican, you can find old letters. Probably, and like, but yeah, you know, like like they wanted something that the average person could read. Yeah, I you don't guess. want like the the. But no, you don't want to have something like important be left out. It's no. like it's kind of like as we all know, it's supposed to be life lessons. But life lessons taken. I don't know about literally because that's kind of well. Extreme. I mean, I, I, some I, life lessons. Yes, yeah. but but I, I like I was arguing with Jose before. I believe that they taught the Old Testament as literal text because Maybe they had to back convince the, a whatever. bunch of people to stop fucking their brothers and pigs and, <laughs> and lambs. And, yeah, like, <laughs> stop they, fucking your lambs. There was a lot of and <laughs> stop, stop like, fucking your build a bears. <laughs> 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 My guy caused a flood back in the day. Well, <laughs> like, I wouldn't blame him. Ancient Alex with like a beard in the corner. Never! Never! Oh, sweet Jesus. I will never give up. Fisting um, things all day long. Um, but, but, yeah, it's because of you, They Alex. had a lot of problems. They were just murdering each other. Like, they had a lot of issues. They had 4,000 Would you years say it's ago. a lot worse than it is today? 4,000 like, years sin, ago? You lived to be around. like 26. That was like the oldest man on earth. All right. Earth. <laughs> like, yeah, it I was worse. Like, <laughs> the sin, uh, Compare sin to today and sin compared to before God um, flooded the earth. What would you well, yeah, worse? like sin now is like we, almost one, acceptable. I think it's worse now just because one, we have the bit like your day is not spent of like how do I save myself, more like, how do I like, better myself, like how do I find my food, how do I like like back then they were they spent most of their time trying not to die. And so we have a lot of time and a lot more resources. Yeah. So there's a lot more like crazy like fucked up shit on the internet. Yeah. So I think there are. I I think human beings have spent four thousand years trying to figure out how to do the most fucked up shit possible. I think that God doesn't like how much knowledge we have. Like, like, oh, you have the internet. 
Fuck that. I'm, I'm wiping the world out in 2012. So God fuck is that. like, fuck internet. Fuck, fuck the internet. Right, fuck right. human knowledge. You know too much. But how wipe shitty, you out. But how shitty internet connection is, like, <laughs> God's like, I'm still wet. God has <laughs> DS- DSL. Yeah, God, <laughs> God, God is the cable guy. Who just, like, every time you're having just, like, a really good day, he's just like, pulls out a clock. <laughs> <laughs> he had fiber octaves before we know what, you know, what fossil fuel was. All right, then. So what's Conti- the next point? Continuing. Well, just well, a, for a while. Th- this, this is a liter- another literal one. It's just the fact that the United States is way too dependent on oil because they refuse to go into alternative energy sources. Oil, well, well, they're trying to change. Uh, no, they're not. No, they're no, not. They're, no, there's, there's, there are people that want to I try to change, but the oil you know companies what? are so embedded in our government that they would never I don't know what, what uh, st- I don't know what it is, what company it is, but they're trying BP? to do... <laughs> Is it BP? No, it's not. Oh, I, I think you know they are trying though. Sure they're trying they, to do. Uh, s- they have to do something. They're trying to do yeah. like the electric or like the the uh, what's what's the E? What's it called? E eighty five. No, 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 no. What's the the corn thing? Ethanol. Ethanol. Oh, yeah, they're, yeah. Tr- they're actually like going through with that. Every now. well, every gas company has has a minimum ten percent of ethanol, and now some gas stations have E eighty five, which is eighty five percent ethanol, fifty percent mm. unleaded gasoline. Mm. Well, but well, the difference is America like. Compare like there's actual, um, actually, you know what? But it's not even America. Like it's not like England. It's, it's just full it, of hybrid, uh, like hybrid cars. Well, yeah, guess it's what? Everywhere. Brazil's fucking self sufficient in Brazil terms of fuel. Brazil's a crazy weird little like hey, no. island country. Forget, well, forget. I don't mean Brazil. Island, like, what are we? I mean Brazil is like, like they're, they're self sufficient. Like uh-huh. I don't mean they're like literally. An island. Yeah, they're, they're, not they're, an they're island. self-sufficient. All their fuel is fucking made out of cane I know, sugar. But they've been doing that for a while. They they and they yeah. have like their own like they can survive on their he, own like economy wise. Like they're like when Kyle says like yeah they've been on it for a while. We've been on oil for like and gas for. A long time. That was then we have to ball. make this big exchange, and all these companies are like, "Yeah, but you know why no, we're not? You, you, no, know, we're you, you know we're not so making much. this. You know why we're not making this exchange? Reason number three: fucking politicians. Well, no, no, uh, yes and no. It's that they're they are in bed with oil companies because oil companies well, lobbyists. Fund their, yeah, yeah, Lobby, yeah. Lo- lobbyists. Would, like, What's the new side job that needs to be eliminated though, right right now? Who? Inside job, I mean, like the thing between like politicians and oil companies, because like the reason. Well, well, it's, not just, well it's not just oil companies. It's, it's, it's all it's any, the, any, the, the, the part of the economic downfall is because of the high. Like, like remember in two thousand seven when the gas prices got ridiculous? Yeah, yeah. Well, everybody stayed home and went on vacation. The econ- that was part of the well, that why the economy went down. That made it worse. It was the main yeah, problem. Pretty much. Was, most of the economy went down because all the banks start going. Yeah, that was yeah. The that's, that's, that's the main the, point. The banks <laughs> had no money because they were giving out bad loans. That but was <laughs> a stupid mistake on their part. Have but. you seen uh, Too Big Fail? Yeah. The the HBO uh, movie. Oh shit! You got it. Paul Giamatti's in it. Um, uh, they, it's basically it's the story of what went on that mm. day. Like basically when we almost lost Hello. our economy, mm. like entirely, and it's wait wait margin off. call. What? Is that what you said? No, it's too big to fail. Oh, okay. No. Oh, it's fucked up. It's on yeah. HBO all the time. You like, you can find it. It's it's really good. Cool. But I, it's just, you know, it's it's the fact that lobbyists they and from see, every company. You see how interconnected they all are. Like yeah. the, the secretary of, of the treasury was like the former head of Lehman Brothers and like oh yeah uh, or Goldman Sachs. Like, like just no, it's Goldman. Just, Sachs. Yeah, I think it was yeah. Goldman Sachs. Um. It's just everybody's in bed with everybody, and everyone's like dependent. Like back with the gas thing and everything, it's like they don't want to change because solar is so much, but it works. Mm. It's great money. So like I have like uh, three... solar energy is not enough. Like it, there's not enough funding. Into, the technology is not as great as you think it is. But the problem it is saves nobody... us half on it's... our bill for heating. We have like three panels on our house. And yeah, it but saves us a lot believe it or not, this, the, it's not as efficient as you think. Like it could and be also, so, it could be so much better if they actually put some funding into the damn research. But that's like, well, then that's, think about that's it. That's it could be so much say, better. Is that you could do it if you put more money into the research, but people don't like it, people aren't taking a risk on it. It's like where does so the it, sun go the, at night? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> people are still afraid of. It's not a risk. risk. It's just they're not, they're, they refuse to do it because they're getting money from the oil companies. And, and no, else, because there would be like. It, like, 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 say, like Apple. All Apple would need to do, and Apple's not in bed with oil companies. Apple's the richest fucking co- corporation on earth. And what? Uh, and, and they like all they need to do is be like, oh, I think solar energy is a good idea. But nobody wants to do it because nobody knows for a fact that that it's going to work. And out. what there's there's electric uh, for cars and like other stuff, and that's like that's proven to work, right? Yeah, that's, yeah, and that's uh, really they have, viable. They've electric cars now that go pretty goddamn fast, dude. Just. Do like that. Have the recharging stations like they have at 
all the other things and make that like the new gas thing. But like try is, to like change. The problem is, and this is where it comes, it's economics, all about politics. This is yeah. where economics and politics come into it. No, listen, it's that you can't charge the same amount of money for a recharge for a recharge as you do for gas, and paying that money to go to gas goes to the economy. It's you. It's a lot. A ton of the money from our economy is just from gas. We'll use it for like a, a Wait, power what? thing, like I a thought life. It all uh, goes to the Middle East. Who, who says no. it goes to our economy? Because no, you does. pay tax. You pay tax on, on gas. gas? Yeah. yeah. What? Yeah. Anyway, you're fucking kidding me, right? You know? Do you know why gas in New Jersey is so cheap? Why? Well, because okay, okay, attack gas like, in New Jersey right. is so cheap because they refuse to pay the insurance required to allow customers to pay their own, to, like fill up their own tanks. The That's price. why everyone's a, a full service. Well, okay, yeah. I, I, I thought you meant like after no, no, full service tax, is more expensive. You get you fill up your tank. They add to but that's all full service. Okay, service. Oh, yeah, 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 there's, yeah. A, there's a yeah. tax yeah. embedded I, I, with the price. I confused myself there. Embedded with the price. Yeah. Okay. All right. That makes sense. And and you know, that makes sense. Okay. All right. So people pay so much. You know, pay so much. But most of the money goes to the Middle East. That's where they get their money. Not really. Most of the companies who buy their oil from, from the Middle, Middle East. East. Like, yeah. It's a different and, – and most of our oil does not come from the Middle East. It comes from – I don't know. Everywhere. It comes from Russia. Some parts um, of Russia. Uh, Ca- uh, not Canada. They're, they said recently most of our oil does not come from the Middle East. Um, really? Yeah. Don't they have uh, – wasn't it in South America someplace? Yeah, or, I was about to say or, somewhere in South America, Russia, and like uh, – and probably China, but <laughs> that's probably. just because we own, you know, everything that we Depends have. where the hottest oil rig is, you know. But, um, <laughs> and I'm not saying it's going to power a car, but just, like, in general terms. Hamsters? Yes. No, Go that's the second the thing. Uh, <laughs> no, like, wind. Cats chasing hamsters. Good, good point. Dude. <laughs> yeah, point one goes dead. No, yeah. wind. Like, wind. Oh, well, that's what my dad keeps saying is why the hell don't we just have wind farms off of. But it would just take so many of them. But, and, you know, no, the also, good thing about it is, like, it would create, like, a public works thing. Like, yeah. everybody can work on that. So not only are you saving money on energy, you're creating but jobs. you're, ge- yeah, creating jobs for everybody. And my, da- my dad always says, why are we not, why don't we have water, like, water fans, or, like, offshore, like, that the tide, like, the, yeah. Like, Especially like, us. But, yeah. Well, I, I can't but understand the middle of the Midwest, but us, we're living on water. Midwest, um, can you think about that? It's just, like, it's nothing out yeah, there. You Nevada. Just, like, there's nothing in Nevada. They, they can use wind, I guess. That's not gonna give them much. But, no, but, but we have wind and water. So. We have water. Put put. We have a whole fucking ocean. Why are we not powering the wall like the world with like? And it's something. Sometimes like when I go to Connecticut, we cross this one bridge, and there's like scatterbrain windmills, <laughs> and I'm like, put them together. <laughs> They're alone. They're lonely. <laughs> they want a friend. <laughs> they want a friend. <laughs> They're just standing there. <laughs> And it upsets me. <laughs> and politics is hard. Politics is hard. We've, we've, we've gone into a new phase where, in the last 30 years, where we don't really know what politics is. Yeah, I mean, you, you get know. four idiots on mic and think they could be politicians. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. But no, but no. I'm not but, saying that we're not we're idiots. we're better than, like, people that go out and are like, I'm going to become a politician. Like, that's not... Professional politicians are the worst people on earth. Like, why yeah, would you... Because they get bought out. They're selling a... Why would you want to buy – like, you shouldn't want to buy the presidency because you, you know you're not going to be a good president. Well, like, they don't they don't care. The, uh, the person who do, is doing that doesn't I care. I disagree because you but have we're, to – But want, we care. But you have to want to change something to become the president of the United States because it's the well, shittiest a lot of, job in the whole world. Well, a lot of people just – They don't get paid them. They, 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 get, they barely they get, get paid a six-figure salary. Well, they, they, they get paid 100000 Yeah, it's not good. They, yeah. They, but, yeah, they get paid that's why they get the lobbyists and shit but, like that. That's why they get paid on the side to do this. They, they're all, and besides, they're they all don't businessmen really have, and lawyers that have money beforehand. Yeah. But you have to well, want to change them because it's the shittiest job ever because everyone hates you. I, uh, I think it's just sometimes it could just be the title. I mean I some know. people want the title or something. there's no like. good – like the, the president, president is always going to fuck up because they don't have control of what happens. The, the world changes, and they have They don't have that much power at all. They don't. And everybody they blames it on the president. Yes, like it's, exactly. No, Congress what about Congress? <laughs> Congress doesn't exist. But the, uh, the exists. courts don't uh, exist. The Congress, president countries, makes everything happen. <laughs> ev- like, everything that happens in the world falls it's, on his fucking yes, shoulders. Yes, it's like, oh, like this is happening. It's your fault, president. Get somebody else. What the fuck yeah. is wrong with you? You're not right. stopping Alex from fisting like, bears. Like, <laughs> Barack Obama might have just lost the election yesterday. I don't know. Be- because There's we so now many invaded fe- Libya. And that's now another war we're in. 
Wait, what? What happened? Well, yeah, because they fucking killed our I, ambassador. I'm aware, but I'm saying because he was in office at the time when that happened, and he has to go. He, like, he, like, he has no choice. You can't be like, all right, they killed our guys. We're, guess we're not going in. Yeah, I know. So he sent in troops. So that automatically reflects bad on him. Like, that you're, that you're now in All you war. have to say is... I killed Osama bin Laden. I, I can kill these motherfuckers too. Yeah, I don't. Even though this is, yeah, it is a good point, I don't think but it's also, good enough for him to win the election. The fact that Mitt Romney is now blaming Obama, uh, I can't remember the exact story. Romney made some sort of comment. Is he a, is, oh, a completely uh, is a he fictional a, comment that he made? No fucking sense. Yeah, but everyone he knows that. that Obama no knew it, yeah, like, yeah, no, uh, that was. It, I don't know. You, I don't think. If the Republican nominee actually had a brain. <laughs> Uh, Every, everyone, the everyone knows he Rip Ron, Mitt Ron, <laughs> gave his name right, Alex. Rip Dick Mommy Clark. is an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> everyone knows he's like he, he's an asshole. He just is. He's uh, not a very warm person. He's, he's a, a no, no, cold person. I don't person. even think he's an asshole. I just think he's, he's a cold de- person. I think he's completely. De- I don't even think he's cold. I think he's just he's completely de- detached from the, yes, from the he, average person. Yes, he is. Because he was born with a. He was born rich. Not even silver. He remained rich. Like a platinum spoon. He can't relate to the. And spit it out. It was like, give me diamonds. He can't relate to the average American. Give me a build And that, that battles me why... <laughs> Made <of> emeralds. <laughs> battles me why the average American might like him. Because he can't... Well, yeah. He, he can't... You know, like, they don't connect. So they, they're they totally different people. He's a rich businessman. Well, that's why he's trying to be like, oh, America and home and pie. And, and well, the problem <laughs> is... Coming from a man who will make over 8 million jobs in every other country. So yeah, we but they like, don't oh care. They, the like, look past the, the people who, like, like this guy, this candidate. No, but they don't. That's the problem. Republicans don't No, like no, 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 no. Really? General people. I'm, I'm pretty sure. Oh, no, yeah. no, no, I'm not From saying the actual party yeah. because they don't like They them. hate They, they don't right. like this guy at all and because. The whole party is a mess because they have like five different factions and they, they just well, they, you they know agree with they each other. What, they don't know what they are anymore. They don't know. Like, no, because. It was, a, it was originally like small government ideals. Now they don't know. Like yeah, there's like they, libertarian Republicans, non you know, whatever. Which libertarian Tea party. Republican is completely <laughs> counter. Like, well, you know what? There's an oxymoron. And then 9 like, 11 kind of clashed everything because then you had like the fanatic people who were like on the like America and we got to defend it. Yeah. And real fiscal conservative Republicans. Yeah, they've just gone. They don't like They that. don't They're exist like, anymore. This is our party. There's like, too conservative. We well, were the, like, we most... like, Reagan was one of us. Like, it's either crazy. you're not a conservative or you're the most extreme person like, on the planet. But that's the difference is that one, Mitt Romney was a conservative Republican. Yeah, from day one, he was and he agreed with a lot of Democratic he, plans, and then he flip flopped. He was yeah, he was he was like a super. He was a he was a middle of the road like, uh, uh, what do you Republic. call it? Go, uh, governor of uh, Massachusetts. Massachusetts. He had a governor of most and, Democratic state, and he yeah. and he put you know had a plan a health care plan essentially the same thing as Obama's, pretty damn close. And he came out just recently saying he's going to keep a lot of of uh, Obamacare. Yeah. Are you serious? Yeah. Like, because the, the biggest because thing to rip on Republicans is Obamacare. They fucking hate Reba- Obamacare. Yeah, but they, they could say, <laughs> dude, they could say one thing and, and just like, another. yeah, Obamacare. exactly, yeah. Um, <laughs> I know they say different things every single debate, but whatever, it doesn't matter. But um, but also say, but uh, last last election, McCain, very 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 liberal leaning Republican. Yeah. Because they've been trying to get the stink off George of George Bush yeah. off the country. But because, then, like all the. Party members, like the actual but party then, members, don't like him. But then they keep putting them with fucking crazy people. Paul Ryan, running mate. No, Rick Santorum. He's no, a fucking no, crazy no, 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 no. Paul Ryan is the running mate. What? Is that, is oh, poor Ryan. Th- yeah. th- th- uh, what, that what? fucking whack the, job. Yeah. He's uh, he's not a good person. To have. Like, <laughs> well, he's a vice president. It's like yeah. the stupidest. Well, thing he, ever. Joe Biden. All right. In, in, in his defense, <laughs> crazy. I love Joe Biden. He's the right. dumbest human <laughs> being on the planet. You know That's what? why. So, in his defense, like he did say one thing that most people like. Was like, okay, uh, college students shouldn't live their twenties in their mother's. Bedroom, uh, in, yeah. in their childhood bedroom. Basically. Yeah, they should. Yeah, Wait, that's, that's what he says. That's what he but said. He said they should, have, they should find jobs for them. Like, like that. That's one thing I can defend them on, but I don't know anything about anything else. Yeah, they want to. Do you know, do you know what their plan is for student loans? I don't Nothing. know anything about that. They're they're basically get, taking away scholarships and loan opportunities. Like that's Obama's thing is trying to keep like loan lo, like loan. Uh, what do you call it? Uh, loan debts. Yeah, like low yeah. and like like, low. A, like ta- he taking like. He, like, that's his thing, Dude, like, always. Yeah. And they've basically been like, 
the Republican stance is you have to be able to stand on your own. So that's totally contradicting what they're saying. Yeah, and also Paul Ryan is a, is basically a religious psychopath, and he's rich is as he? fuck too. Yeah, he's a, he's. And, well, I, don't know, I don't know much about him. That's he, only it, oh, we're gonna stand on our own while I did yeah. nothing to better myself and I was born you know rich. You yeah. know what? Yeah. Remember back when we just we made the law you know, like separation between church and state? Well, that no. totally went out the door. Like, yeah, and every Republican but, religion. But that, every no, Republican that, was like that. Never God. has been reinforced. Then, then you no, had those wacko that, yeah, that never people. went out the door. That I mean, I mean, that never was. It was in the door. No, no president yeah. ever had ever like. I won't well, watch. no, no, there I'm was sorry. the wacko Republican conservative Tea Party, whatever. The but ev- but every, Sarah LePan- there's uh, only been one Palin non- was like, oh, this. I refuse to like the person who like wants to meld those two together. Like, oh, I like a, a little literal question. Like at one Republican debate months ago was like, yeah, how is your like commitment to God? Yeah, like, it was like, what does that have to do with anything? Like, come on, like this is politics. This is to not be involved says in Christianity. The, the difference I is just that have up morals. to 50 years ago, up to 50 years ago, it was directly involved because, you know, most people were Christian. And that was yes, like, but now most it, people well, that counted in the world, quote unquote. Christian. Well, 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 no, Christian. back in the, uh, what was it? It was the JFK election. They were like very he's, concerned he's, that he was a uh, Christian. Yeah, Catholic. Yeah, They're like, no, we can't do this because he's, he's, he's going to fuck up shit. He's <laughs> the only non-Protestant yeah, uh, he was the uh, first Catholic uh, uh, president. Yeah. yeah, he was. We might be getting our first Mormon president. <laughs> oh, no. That's no. not happening. Oh, those wacky Mormons. Okay, this All right. Do you, like, think, like, do you think Book of Mormon is just going to, like, get, uh, yeah. like, taken off of Broadway if he yeah. gets it? I don't know. <laughs> I have a love here relationship with Obama, but, like, I, I would have vote him. So well, Mitt Romney wouldn't could, like go no, on vote, vote, vote. <laughs> I but, but I, I need I don't to know, vote man. my first election. I need to. Barack Obama isn't the problem. Like, what like I don't? It's he's shit doing versus shit. No, so. I agree. You <laughs> see what he's been doing? Bad. Like Obama's a lesser a of two he's evils. Saying, no, yeah, really, he's done a lot with a really shitty situation. Yeah, like he's still, kept everybody us, hates him. He's kept because everyone always hates the president unless you're Bill Clinton for some reason. He got his. He <laughs> Bill got his, Clinton got a blowjob and still came out of it. Yeah, okay. like, like <laughs> have you seen that guy now? He's the coolest motherfucker on the list. Yeah. He's just like I can do anything. He's gonna run again. <laughs> I win. Quentin 2016. I think everyone. Are they allowed to? No. I wish every. I think everyone wishes he would, though. He could. They should change the law. You, you get Wait. two terms. Since no, no, no. You can come back though. No, never. it says two consecutive really? terms. No, no, you get two terms. That's it. Yeah, you get two okay. terms in office. You can never come back. That's why he's so relaxed. He made it to the highest place and has nothing else to do. He's like, I was president of the United States. We came out above. Like, we came out ahead. I win. Like, and, like. I I'm just going to go play my sax. <laughs> I lied <laughs> about one blow job, man. Everything was pretty damn good. But, like, uh, he came out. We were, like, the economy was high. Jobs were, just, like, like um, what do you call it? Uh, um, uh, what, you, uh, what? When you're out of work. Unemployment? Unemployment was really low. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> when you're out of work. Really, Unemployed. Kyle? Yeah. Uh, un- wow. When, when I'm you the don't drug have war. employment. I'm the drug warrior. Um, uh, <laughs> It, it, it was it was just uh, like like we we were in a really good place. And we just, were in a really good place. Then I, I feel more relaxed now. I feel like I want to spend more. I'm nice and happy. Then we're everything's relaxed. just everything was just bad. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty everything much everything fucks. It. But uh, yeah. Next. All right, we still got a list, by the way. <laughs> wow, I think we got. Oh, all really? right. Politicians. How long do we get on? Like, I don't like getting on political no, terms on a podcast. Like all right minutes. then. Yeah, the, the next got, problem with America is the is the fact that we're becoming social media zombies and internet trolls. Uh, that is not America. That's that a world. Is, that is all. That's kind of that the world. Is, that's all. Uh, if, if you're civilized, fir- if you're first world, then that's basically what yeah. you're doing. If you're not, if, that's yeah. That's yeah. The only thing that are, people are innocent over that is the third world countries because you know they are computers. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> and, and some of them still do that. Too. Yeah, yeah. Facebook yeah. trolls. Ah, fuck trolls. And my final problem with America. Alex's joystick corner. Oh, that is an American problem. Bob that, should we are that running shit. for president on that platform. There is. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what the platform is, but. You know what? Thor's in favor of Alex's joystick corner is getting my vote this election. <laughs> <laughs> Alex joystick corner. He'll vote for you today. <laughs> Vote for her in favor of Alex Joyce the Corner. Alex Probably just outside me. the Capitol with signs like, 
Man bear love. <laughs> Giving out underage Probably been wrong, jobs. maybe, because he's Mormon. He loves incest, so maybe he'll get that my That is ball. not the same thing. <laughs> yes, it is. Mormons love incest. No, they don't. No, that's no, monogamy. They don't. All right, every when, no, you're, they when don't. you're on the news no, and you hear about an incest family, it's usually a Mormon family. No, Come on. it's usually a bunch of crazy hillbillies. It's Mormon family. It's a in, bunch of stupid rednecks. In, ten- in, in Oregon, in, in Texas, whatever, they're Mormon. <laughs> That's not where the Mormons are. <laughs> <laughs> Utah. Okay, Utah. That's yeah, where you live. That's where the Mormons that's are. That's where the incest is. They're not incest, is. dude. They that's where the incest is. The opposite yes, of incest. They, they marry a bunch of people that aren't related to them. Incest. That's, <laughs> that's, 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 that's not incest. And talking to the mic. Yes. But Retard, do you know what incest is, number yes, one? Yes, marry a family sex with your own family. Okay, then. And if also, a stuffed bear is not your own. Right. If they're married to everybody, then it's... Everyone's they your family. They're not married to everyone. <laughs> <laughs> yes, they are. The whole, the whole state of Utah is married to everyone. Yes, they're all married Holy to Holy shit. I'm about to beat the shit this out of this one fuck. Orgy. You can have sex with anyone because you're married there to everyone. Is, once a week in this park, everybody in Utah is gathered to have one fucking big orgy. <laughs> That's like... Right by the Salt That's Lake. So that bird. Great Salt Lake. Everyone fucking There's each other. It's so salty. <laughs> okay. There's Alex. sea animals in Utah. Oh, oh, Incest generally happens in the South, not fucking Utah. I'm pretty okay. sure I've heard stories of Utah. No, that is that is the like the incorrect stereotype for Mormons that they fuck this. You're gonna say it's, but it is a stereotype. No, Alex, nonetheless, if you're gonna say if I'm right or wrong, incest, it's Nebraska. Exactly. Please. Okay. Nebraska. Ironically, they vote Republican. <laughs> I would say Arkansas. That doesn't really help They're your argument. Up. All right, fine. <laughs> How does that not help his argument? I lost <laughs> <laughs> like a job from an intern. That is not anything remotely in the same Win. area. <laughs> I, want my I know, really. Like that. That's what pisses me off. It's like want... a grown adult, like. And like that's what like he got impeached about. Yeah, like, well, he wasn't impeached. Oh my like, god! Yeah, he almost got impeached yeah. about. Like, god damn it! He's like, you know what? President didn't get a blowjob. Like, every <laughs> president got probably a blowjob. Probably everyone, but he's but Abe Lincoln Abe got Lincoln a blowjob. Was probably gay. You know what it is? The internet came around. He still got a blowjob. That's what I'm saying. I'm saying he's still got I'm a blowjob. Abe Lincoln was probably gay, and he's like one of the most beloved uh, right. presidents of all time. The, and we. Oh, president. nobody's forgotten that. It's just Everyone's that just like, win with that. The <laughs> unfortunate fact that Bill Clinton came around when the internet spawns. Well, I think if he got shot and killed, people would be like, oh, that was such a loss. But I think that's why everyone's fine with you. You either die or you go. Or you live long enough you either to die see or yourself or become George Bush. <laughs> 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 yeah, you either, yeah, exactly. That's what happens. But but that was a bigger thing. I think a lot of people hated Bill Clinton for a long time because he got a blow. I want my president to be relaxed. Yeah, <laughs> I, you know, cool, like, chill guy. Smoke weed. Like with you, you know? if you if you have like world ending issues on your like lap, you need and then a blowjob comes oh, up. Oh, yeah, so you, cool. Jesus Christ! You want your president to be stressed for it. Stop the car. It's so cool. <laughs> Just trust me. Trust me. It's cool and everything's good. Once you said that, I don't know what he's it's saying good. anymore. I don't know. Man. I think like, he's, he's so – you're so – Are you drunk? <laughs> Alex is drunk. He can't speak anymore. Yeah, Alex is I, I th- drunk. I think I have a drink in like 15 minutes, so maybe don't, he's been caught. We're not like, going to let you drive. <laughs> Alex is drunk in oh. corner. Give me your keys. It's only 1046. <laughs> Give me your keys. It's only 1046. Well, it's 5 o'clock somewhere. I'm going to leave by 12, and I'll be fine by then. That's usually how it happens. I plan these things out. Sure. I have like a, I have a mental schedule in my, hi- in my head how I'm going like, to get home. Well, well, we call Alex, so we're, I think we're done recording for the night. I don't even think you're coming through. All right, so Jose said been? we're done recording for the night. How long is, <laughs> wait, has, is this just new, or has this always been that Jose has been coming in in a while? I, what? We, we, no, I, we, His we, mic is not. Jose working. came out. Yeah, how long? Uh, this it's been going today. On this entire thing. Hold up. Stop talking for 30 seconds. Gentlemen. Do you think it's a... Uh, he... Stop for 30 seconds. Okay. I'm still coming in on the feed on the computer. I don't hear it through my head. That's the one that counts, though. The one that comes on the computer, it counts. All right. All right. Uh, that's what's getting recorded. Do you think it's... Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Wait, wait. One more topic. Maybe it's Yeah, Dave's I thought five was an out. Oh, yeah, yeah, right. yeah. Yeah, same uh, thing. I have one question. Yeah. Is it going to be 4G? <laughs> uh, I, I don't, don't think so. Is this they haven't said it, but it would be weird if it wasn't. 
I don't believe. Yeah, why wouldn't it? It's be? still it had, like it was Argo. It didn't, didn't wait, wait, wait. What did you say, Alex? It's longer, or right? Or 4G? It's a what about 4G? Like we don't know if it's gonna be 4G or thing. not. What's gonna be 4G? The iPhone 5. It's going to be the iPhone. The 4S is already 4G. No, it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's the not. The 4S is 4G. Alex, you're drunk. I will vote for you on that. <laughs> My mother has a fucking iPhone 4S. It says 4G on the no. motherfucker. I will put money on the, the 4S is not 4G. Right now. Well, oh, shit balls. That game's out loud and clear. Yeah, you peaked. Yeah, right. <laughs> uh, that might I be why. Fact, this thing the iPhone is not the 4G yet. Then why the fuck does the iPhone 4S say 4G on the damn screen? It's just 4. 4 doesn't mean it's 4G. It says 4G. It's your it, iPhone. I, I need to be a 4S. This is a 4. It shows eight. It shows the bars, the carrier, and no. it shows no. 4G. I don't know. Whoever is the 4S who's What's listening, up? tennis for more five. If you have a 4S, <laughs> to tell Dude. us if your iPhone has 4G on it, because I'm the tennis four... is not gonna get back to you us know, for at least I'm, a month. I am like 99 <laughs> sure the iPhone has been uh, 4G yet. I'm pretty. I'm gonna have to agree with you. Right, it has. No, but not you. No. I'm gonna agree with him. Are huh? you serious? Yes. No, it's not. Because I've seen it. I've seen it with my own two eyes. Nope. The 4S is 4G compatible. You looking nope. it up, Kyle? Nope, nope, nope. Yep. And? Not 4G. Because Fuck I'm you, not. Alex. Some I'm individuals are mistaking the 4S as an indication that the new speedier iPhone supports the LTE standard, more commonly known as 4G. This is not the case. But it says, Thank it's, you. But it says on the de- the phone says 4G on it. No. The, like, iPhone, no. the iPhone 4S does not support LTE. Most likely yes. Apple plans to release an LTE, LTE version of the iPhone. As the How old is that article? Plan. That might be. All right, so the, the 5S. Five. Five. Yes. It came out with the, four, with the 4S. That's the point. The, during, all right, this is this article. Concerning battery life, Apple said the four, iPhone 5 will cover eight hours each for 3G talk time, 3G browsing, and an LTE browsing. So LTE, I think that means 4G because my phone says 4G LTE. Oh, that, that that that's a different thing. 4G and 4G LTE are two different things. Yeah, 4G but just stands for fourth generation. But what he's talking about is the 4G network that the 4G that network. Is, yeah. 4G just yeah. That's what I'm talking but about. 4G network. you see where it says 3G? I'm, I'm talking, about, I'm talking about the speed network, not not the generation. Are you sh- okay? Then because speed. where it says 3G on this phone, it says 4G on the 4S is now, and that ha- and that happened after a while. When they first came out, it still said 3G. A few months later, started they started saying 4G. Foreign heard the iPhone hasn't been 4G yet. I don't know. How do I keep up with this? I don't know. Her he fo- just said that it's the five is going to be. 4G. The five is going to be four G. So I'm, I'm, I don't know. Her I don't, fo- her, her I don't f- think the, the 4G. internet speeds are faster on that phone. I don't think the four S is four G. But whatever. Anyway, and what else is it like new on? I know it's like uh, it's smaller full, and longer. It's probably going to be a bigger screen because like it's going to be four Wider. inches. My yeah. only problem is the is fact that the um, loading that the charging port is smaller now, but yeah, they're, they're the, the transaction is going to happen. There's a, it's it's inevitable yeah, at this that's point. More money. F- uh, well, they what about like the new apps or anything like new iOS like, six? Yeah, but I, don't, I haven't seen anything. I, like I don't think they've they've they haven't revealed that much. So it's basically gonna be like a smartphone, like the the most modern smartphone. Right? It's gonna be four four inch screen which until is, they come out with the six. And yeah, it's gonna be the thinnest phone. It's gonna be the thinnest phone. Whatever they, they say, yeah. it's the thinnest phone in history. I, I, I'm gonna see that for my own eyes. I don't want that. I don't, I don't know, but I don't want it to be that. I remember this. The, the, I like the get an outer box like me it makes it twice as thick. I don't, like, I don't want it to be like super thick, but like this is. Anybody remember, remember the Motorola Razor? That that was the. That was. Really that was thin. I had that. That was just, that. That used to be. Holy the, shit! The, I think it's still thin as phone because I. I haven't seen anything thinner than that. Yeah, yeah the, the Razor. I, the Razor, yeah, that's which is how like they five advertised years old. it. Yeah. Yeah, the thinnest phone ever. And I wasn't a big fan of that phone. Even but, the phones have to be skinny now. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. So, so that I think rant. I fixed my mic, guys. I hope they have. Well, that's the end. <laughs> <Yeah, no, laughs> <laughs> my mic, guys. End of the episode. <laughs> and we're leaving it with that. I, no, but just I. I hope they're. I hope they have cool voices for Siri. Like I hope you can get like Michael Caine as Siri. Oh, like, uh, like GPS. Uh, yeah. I want <laughs> Alan Rickman. Banks. I want Michael Ironside to be the voice of. Oh, my the uh, or just, Jack like, Nicholson. Splinter Cell guy. Yeah. 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 Yeah, Which he's not going to be in the new game. I'm so fucking pissed off. He's Wait. not going to be the voice in the new Splinter Cell game. Yeah, he's They're done. getting somebody new. I'm like, oh my god. It's not Splinter Cell out. without him. I know it's not. It's just your voice. That's how he talks. Yeah. Maybe, <laughs> yeah. You never be. It's like Batman. It's like Splinter Cell. <laughs> the oh, no. I want Stallone. 
Yeah. <laughs> I don't. You'd be so confused where you were going. Uh, yeah. Yeah, you guys. Turn right up. turn. Turn <laughs> up. Adrian. <laughs> Oh, God. My name's Dave. <laughs> you can't afford <laughs> And then he just goes, You can't afford the law! The law! <laughs> Call me Dave, Siri! <laughs> Jesus! Adrian! <laughs> Gets a mind of itself. Okay, well, like, like, Siri really like, interested me. Okay, I, I gave it three. Like, you did three? Yeah. Look, I've been like, for a couple of years. It sounds like, 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 I see people use it. They have, like, little, like, literally conversations with this thing. It's like, Where is it? Like, Siri! Like, they, like, how are you today? I am doing fine. How are you? <laughs> or something like that. Like, People can do that. I don't know why. Because they have no friends. All <laughs> right. It's basically the perfect thing for a person who can't make friends. It's just like have Siri. See, to be <laughs> honest, there's only one time would I, would, I would ever really use Siri if I had it, and that's just to send and re- send listen text messages while I'm driving. Oh, I, w- I would use it all the time. But just to be like, just say fucked up things. Perfect. So. A lot of noise shit. I'm like, talking shit. Yeah, I know, right? So, I guess that's it for today. Oh, oh, oh how many fuck yous have I said? Wow, Shockingly, nine. Two hours nine? nine? Yeah. Two hours and nine minutes is a... Wow. i my record. We've been going for two hours and nine minutes, guys. Yeah, I have a lot Here you of go, right now. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, <laughs> double fuck you, fuck you, fuck <laughs> you. <laughs> oh, count don't, count. Don't, don't count. You're texting. <laughs> we had some laughs. We had some serious moments. And we cried. Well, Alex. <laughs> Alex, yeah. Alex cried. The bears so, cried. Alex <laughs> cried his own joke, which I don't, I don't know how classy that is. But well, not no, 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 no. It wasn't my own joke. It's really you, you, built, you built on yeah, it. Yeah, that yeah, made I me know, cry. I, I, was like, I was like, Dick Clark is not right. Why, <laughs> Dick Clark why is it Dick Clark right? Robin? <laughs> that was hilarious. Oh, my but, uh, but, yeah, yeah. <laughs> We had some fun, and yes. uh, we'll see you next time. So we had I'm curious off. how I'm going to sound like this. I'm probably Wait, like, like, like a douchebag. I don't know. We'll sing backwards. Wait, we just goodbye. Sing goodbye. goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. my God. No. At least for today. No. Just for today. Just for today. No, it's like a reverse. Are you ready? Reverse, oh. motherfucker. Oh, reverse. Okay. Goodbye. 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 goodbye.